So, welcome in, everybody. It is time. After a long, long time, it is time to return to the P3 vibes. Persona 3 Reload is here. It's real. I'm a week late. The game's been out for a few days. Uh, I had to hold off on it so people could get a little ahead of me because I know what's going to happen. But some folks don't. I want to see, you know, see how everybody's doing and enjoying it. And clearly they are. Persona 3 Reload uh, is I've been staying away from a lot of the marketing because there was an abundance of it. And clearly I know Persona 3. You guys have been watching my content for a long time. Persona 3 for beginners. Video is almost 10 years now, <laughs> which is crazy to think about. So high future YouTube me watching this. <laughs> to all the future gamers out there, thank you guys for watching the VODs. Uh, yeah, I've been very eager to play this for a long time. We were anticipating it. Rumors, whispers, when was Persona 3 going to come back? Was it ever going to come back as a remake? And yes, Atlas did surprise us, uh, you know, dropping the trailers uh, last year. And to the shock of everybody, it's real, slick, cooler, better than ever. And uh, while I'm aware of a handful of things that are different, obviously quality of life stuff, uh, again, general mechanics that are, you know, uh, in Persona 5 being put into this. Uh, this is glammed up Persona 3 uh, to the highest degree, but missing the female pro tag. I'll forgive Atlas for now. The rest of this is really fucking cool. So with that, y'all, we're going to be jumping on in. No marathon, no nothing, just raw gamer energy, mainly because I can't min-max because enough stuff is different to where I don't think I have the knowledge to properly min-max. We're going to try, the very least, follow our hearts, and also our love for MILFs and hit up Mitsuru. Uh, but we're going to try. We're just literally vibing out here, guys. I'm here to enjoy it, uh, appreciate it, absorb it as a Persona 3 enjoyer. Let's get into Persona 3 Reload. <sighs> what do? I know we can change this. I'm going to start on normal, and we might increase it later down the line for possible reasons. Who knows? I just want to gauge it and see how easy it is. I've heard this uh, so far is considerably more accessible and easier than Persona uh, 5 Royal, which is saying something because you can snap that game over your knee if you know what you're doing. Uh, so yeah, let's see it. All right, yeah, normal, yeah. I'm just a normal guy doing normal things out here. I also have not seen the opening. Not yet. I know that, like a lot of this stuff has been out and about, but I haven't seen it. Time for waits for no one. All, all are equal in its flow. All lives born to their ends. We're all gamers in the eyes of God. You who would protect the glimmer of the finite future, you have a single- YOU HAVE A SINGLE YEAR! Go forth and live in the time given to you, even in these, uh... Okay, yeah, I can't read that fast, okay? <laughs> yeah, DEPRESSION! DEPRESSION! Let's go! This is gonna be a high school year unlike any other. To d this year, we get on Wellbutrin. Oh, I've not- I have not seen this at all yet. It's crazy that this got a full remake treatment. Like, this is not really something we see from Atlas. You know, we see re-releases, like, remaster editions, la-da-da. This is full glammed up from scratch, brought back, and, uh... <gasps> GAY! <laughs> Wait a second. In the early 2000s? Wow. Now that girl's ahead of her time. Just oh, the dogs. To my head. Oh, she's fine. And then... No, Yukari, no, don't do it! Come on. You have... <laughs> oh, there's no way I can't! No, girl, no, girly pop, you're, you're too, um... Well, she's got problems, actually, she's got issues. Motherfucker, sit down, why are you holding the bo- <laughs> Wait a sec! Who the fuck stands and holds the thing when there's a perfectly good seat? I get you want to look out the window, but you can look out the other side too. Whatever, whatever. I get it, he's cool. He has to stay on settings for losers. Yeah, what what year is it now? Because like in the, in the obviously the original P3 was like 2004 or 5, like at least when it was taking place. This is, uh, I guess, pre-2010, huh? Out of service. Uh-oh. <gasps> Uh-oh, it hit midnight. I sure hope nothing crazy happens. Ah, uh, I think this is a bad time to mention my, like, existential fear of coffins standing in the middle of the night amongst the moon glow. And also my headphones are fucking dead. Now I'm upset. Who left all this fucking jam here, huh? Oh, it's 2009. Okay, specifically. Well, sh he's just unfazed. He's like, well... <laughs> Like, ah, yes, 
It's the, it's the evening jamming. I've arrived so late. I better hurry up. Oh, God. It is... This game is... This is surreal. This is very surreal. Because, like, I've seen... But watching trailers, but promotion material, it looked too good to be true to an extent. Because, like, this is this game is clearly, you know, a lot of P5 the, uh, DNA in here, but... They did go above and beyond to glam it up, but still keep P3's aesthetics, which I thought was really important. And uh, the blue is prevalent. It be popping. It be popping. This is where I'll be staying from now on. It should just be up ahead. The vibes are a little bad. A little rancid. And ooh. Oh. Oh, free. Oh, we can fucking walk. All right. Hell yeah. Free access. Damn. Oh, this is crazy. Oh, I miss this so much. Got to, compared to Persona fucking five, it's just like the, the night and day difference between the openings. It's just like, all right, get on the train. Welcome to your new town. Never mind the mess. It's fine. You can move in the beginning. Yeah. Looks like the power's out. Oh no. Someone pulled out the plug. Uh, I'll, all right, yeah, construction site. Wow, all right, free movement. I'm glad they let us do this now. Kind of set the tone. It's more eerie this way. Uh, hello. I missed the opening song. I did. Okay, promise here. Okay, here's. Is it like does it open? Does it open in the beginning, like during the uh, the menu? Let me get to the dorm, let me hit the save. Basically, like, let me get, like, access to the actual game first, and then we'll jump into the title, we'll watch it then. How about that? And- OH NO! MY GREATEST FEARS! Oh, this is exactly what I didn't want to see out here! <gasps> oh no! Can you imagine just, like, minding your own fucking business, and the midnight strikes, and then it's just like, you blink. All this shit's happening in the meantime. This is cool, I love that they let us walk around here. All right, yeah, guys, just remind me to go back to the title screen. We'll watch the opening. I thought it was going to play in the beginning, but I guess not. All right, yeah, head to the dorm. No, I want to hang out with my new friends. <laughs> and then what? Oh, yeah, the, oh, they got the duck burger. Oh, my God! The fucking blood. Like, coming down. Wow, so many ducks slaughtered. What happens to animals during the midnight hour? Do they get their own little coffins? Or they just not count? present day. We find this handsome blue haired blue wondering what his dinner gonna be when suddenly a golden bun and him get wrapped up on the concept of life and living. <laughs> Hopefully there's no monster in this story. I think everything's gonna be just fine, all right? My reaction, not my business. I'm going back home while getting convenience store food. Yeah, not my circus, not my monkeys, all right? Not the scary geometry. Yeah, this is the, this is the eerie shape. Oh no, oh God. All right, well, let's go to the dorm. The fact that he just gives no fucks, it's his, honestly his best trait. Are definitely, like, P3 Protag is the coolest Protag. P4 Protag is the chattiest. You know, he's like the, the yeah, just the chattiest. He is the chad. Uh, and then uh, P5 Joker is uh, the cutest, but the smelliest. But, like, in a good way. I mean, I mean all of this with love. But, yeah, P3 Protag, definitely the coolest motherfucker alive. Does not give a flying fuck. All right. I'm excited to hear everyone's vocal performances because I've only heard like bits and pieces. Uh, this game did a full new recast dub, which I think was for the better. Um, and for what I've heard, ooh, this is sexy. Ooh, oh baby! Yeah. Now that's eerie titling. I love that. I love the tonal. Ooh, the tonal dip here is great. I like also how the opening of the game says like, Welcome. "Oh shit." <laughs> The opening of the game starts off with like, listen, there's some sad, spooky shit in this game, okay? Take breaks if you need it. A lot, lot of teenagers shooting themselves in the head. There he is. Hi, Pharos. I... He's so fucking funny. <laughs> You're late. <laughs> Elizabeth act uh, uh, actress is still the same. Oh shit, really? Yeah, I'm not sure. I know for the most part it was like, they redid most of the characters. Um, at the very least, what I have heard is that people's voices are either different, but keeps the spirit of the character, um, or they're, like, incredibly on point. I know Mitsuru's voice actors really knocked it out of the park here. Um, so far, Pharaoh's good. So, you know, like, I'm fine with the voices being slightly different and having, like, you know, new actors kind of, like, this is their time to shine. Um, and, uh, as long as they keep the, the, uh, the vibe and the essence of the character, A-OK -okay in my book, you know? 
He's been waiting for me. <laughs> oh, and then he just <laughs> out. Oh, if you wish to motherfucker, you <laughs> sign your name here. It's a contract. I'm gonna have to have my, my lawyer look this over. Uh, There's no need to be scared. No, I no you. I should never never sign shit you don't read. All it says is that you accept full responsibility for your actions. Pharos, but what if it's someone else's fault? Okay, what if I get wrapped up in someone else's nonsense? Where's the clause on, you know, oopsie whoopsie fucky wucky? All right, now now the moment of truth, y'all. Here we go. Oh God, what are we gonna do? Uh, please sign your name. Oh jeez. okay, here we go. Y'all, what are we doing? Not G <laughs> GB Weeby, I love GB Weeby. First name GB, last name Weeby. <laughs> Revolver dorsalot. That is a good one. I don't know if we have enough letters for that. Not blue bread. Um. <laughs> okay. How do we feel about GB Weeby? I just love. I love. I love me some good. <laughs> I love me some good Weedman uh, jokes in P3. John Persona. I love me some John Persona. Some kind of door pun. Melon pan. <laughs> You got an art on the SMT system. Oh, that's right. Back in the Nocturne. Bread bun. Okay, hold on. Door coon. That's a good one. I love I love John Persona. I love saying John anything with the last name. Uh, full responsibility. Gen Alpha's worst nightmare. Um, <laughs> I'm John Persona. GB Weeby is great. I just love... <laughs> <laughs> I was also thinking of doing like Danny Depresso, cause like we did P3 Portable and we named her Deborah Depresso, you know, to keep the vibes going. Um, I could name it like Wellbutrin XL. I also think that's really fucking funny, but that's just like a me joke. Uh, <laughs> Met the Child, the Toast remake, John Depression. All right, I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm seeing a lot of GB Weebies. Guys, I think we're, go we're gonna go GB Weeby. <laughs> first, first name GB, last name Weeby. Danny, okay, you guys like Danny Depresso? I just love alliterations. You got, okay, okay, you guys lit up for Danny Depresso. John Wellbutrin, I think is a good one. All right, mm, okay, Danny Depresso. I think, I think that's a winner. All right, and then. You can't go wrong. He's true to himself. It's in the name. Can we vote? Okay, yeah. Can we make a poll, I guess, to uh, one of the mods who has access to it? Can we get a poll? Or a, actually, huh, maybe I can do it. Hold up. Can I do the... Okay, we'll poll it. How about GB Weeby or Danny Depresso? All right. All right, vote! Vote! It is... <laughs> Go, guys. Danny Depresso's winning. <laughs> Weeby son, please enjoy the stay in your dorm. <laughs> Depresso coon. Democracy is reigning. Oh, wow, oh, yeah, Danny Depresso's winning. Danny Depresso sweep! Wait, you just did uh, GB Weeby. We could just go for Jinky Winky out of respect for Vel. <laughs> if this was P4, I would do that just for the, the you know, the fucking gang solving mysteries. Jeepers rise up! Dicks out! That dicks out for Depresso! <laughs> Danny GB Weeby Depresso. Okay, all right. How about that? If this, it, all right, it looks like Danny Depresso has won. I'm gonna call it early because oh good god, that's gap. And uh, an honorary middle name, uh, GB Weeby. All right, we got we got that like two last names things going on. We got you know uh, Danny GB Weeby Depresso. Yeah, that's his full name. That's his legal name. <laughs> Let's go. Danny Depresso coming here to save the world. All right, one antidepressant at a time. Let's do it. 
Confirm. Hold up. Boop, boop, boop. A, 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 enter. Here we go. H, uh, there we go. Danny Depresso. Did I spell that correctly? Actually, did I spell that correctly? You guys know me. Are we good? People who can spell. People with working eyes, let me know. <laughs> Danny GB, the depressive weepy. <laughs> Random guy. <laughs> Thank you for gifting a sub to Jeevers! <laughs> oh my god, here they are. My dyslexia says even yes, then let's go. Let's go with this, guys. We're getting it. Let's do it. Let's meet. Let's meet the crew. Let's get the little tour. To freedom! Are you gonna romance buns toaster with boo? Honestly, I guess his voice acting seems way better in this one, or at least more lively. Maybe. I don't know who I'm going to like in this one. The voices will make a big difference. My style, but I just wanted to pop in and say hi. Oh, shit. Crab, thank you. Thank you for popping in always with those good vibes and the good love. Thank you so much for the buck. The very, at least I, I don't know. So possibly give, give P3 a shot. I don't know. Then again, I don't know if it is. If you try your vibe, I totally get it. But still worth a shot, though. Thank you so much for the, 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 uh, the dollar with that. All right. Pharaoh's good, 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 good. And he like smells it. Mmm. <laughs> Time is something no one can escape. It yeah. delivers us all to the same end. Tell me about it. You can't plug your ears or cover your eyes. Yeah, I think we chose the right name. And so, it begins. <laughs> okay, he's way more extra in this one. I'm kind of about it. Who's there? And so oh. <laughs> Rika. Oh, hey! Hey, girly pop! Here at this hour. How are you here? Mama! Tell me. Hold on, let's do auto. She's glocked up! Wait. She's gonna shoot us with her feelings. Hey, mama. The lights. I didn't think you'd arrive so late. <laughs> My name is Mitsuru Kirijo. Oh, she sounds great. The students who live in the storm. Yeah, students, air quote. Students, air quote. Who's he? Uh, don't worry about it, Mitsuru. That's what good pussy sounds like. <laughs> I'm sorry, Yukari. Don't worry about it, Yukari. Mitsuru, you should worry about it. decision to assign him here. He'll eventually be moved to a room in the boy storm. Is it okay for him to be here? <laughs> I guess Man. we'll see. Also, one of my running headcanons is, and I think the game is way better if you perceive it this way, Mitsuru, not a high schooler. This girl is 25 years old, all right, and she's pretending to be in high school because she's just trying to get, like, that extra credit or something like that. This is a girl who is min-maxing, like, being undercover in school or something. Like, she's, write, she's like an investigative journalist, and she's, like, writing an article. I don't know. You, you, whatever you want to, like, apply to why she's 25 and pretending to be in high school, but she is 25 pretending to be in high school for whatever reason. She's a psyop, I don't know, but... <laughs> her family owns the school, exactly that! What if it's a case where, like, she's 25, her parents own the school, because, like, they're fucking giga-rich, and she's just, like, laying low, you know, and just, like, pretending to be a student so she can just get, like, cheap dorm, uh, uh room fees, you know what I'm saying? VA is the same VA as Bloodhound from Apex Legend. Oh, now that's range. Rascal, thank you for the dollar. I did not know that. That is actually, wow, that is, that is fucking range. She's doing, doing a great job. Yeah, she's doing a 21 Jump Street Google it. Yeah, that's it. She's doing, she's, uh, she's undercover at the school trying to figure out where all the drugs are coming from. She's trying to, <laughs> she's undercover. <laughs> um... <laughs> She burned her bread too many times a few years. Uh, yeah, she's back for round two. Mitsuru was tw Mama. Blitz Fritz, that, that name does that fuck around. You're blitzing like crazy. Good afternoon. Oh, for real? You're having a good day oh my god. February 10th. Chat, remember to drink your water and eat snacks during stream breaks. I'll be lurking for the moment, but I'll be enjoying the burn. The burn dread blitz. What the? <laughs> what? That was power in that. You know exactly what you were doing. Intentional. <laughs> thank, thank you. We got. <laughs> wow! Incredible. Holy 
Ixi. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for the blessings on that. Thank you. Thank you. Also, yeah, guys, drink your water. Thank you for reminding Here. You hear that? This is my knockoff Stanley cup uh, that I got from Ross. That's a big sip of water for you, baby. Thank you. Thank you so much. Holy cannoli. There we go. There we go. Look who's on top of the game. Thank you for that blitz. Really fucking blitzing out here. I wanted to. Congrats on being top bun with that. No, and then drag. Okay, you got this. <laughs> Said the gang song. We just got back. Why are we freaking? We're going fucking crazy. Dragon Warriors, thank you for the 1200. Thank you, thank you. Unstoppable. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you for the generosity. I say we got g gamers up for Mitsuru, am I right? Uh, not the second wedding. <laughs> Keep both it even on the screen. <laughs> Mitsuru's old bonjour, bonjour, croissant, and Danny Depresso's like, we. I am yeah, I'm very, I'm very wee wee for Mitsuru. This Guys, Yukari talk about but thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. What a blessing. Aww. What is about Persona, y'all? Come get you coming out here. Also, hi, Yukari. I'm sure, I'm sure everything's fine, right? How's your dad? Yeah? How's your relationship with your parents? Call me Takeba. I'm gonna be- Oh, I'm glad they kept us here. Why do you have a gun? Mama! Huh? Why are you glocked up? Uh, it's sort of like a hobby? They got an- They got an NRA out here in Japan? I mean, not a hobby, but- <laughs> She's an enthusiast. Honestly, if this was America, you'd be like, oh, okay. You know how it is these days. It's for self-defense. Where were you on January 6th, Yukari? <laughs> it's not a real- It's for- it's for self-defense. All right, yeah, it's a lighter, my bad. It's getting late. It's a taser, You'll yeah. Your room at the end Practicing your Second Amendment rights, uh-huh. Unlike this blue-haired liberal out here. Your things should already be there. Why don't you get some rest? Well, I'll show you the way. Follow me. Also, how is the volume? Can you guys hear the game? I feel like it can be a little louder. Here, hold on, hold on. Oop, clicked out. Yeah, we're gonna go 12. There we go. No, nah, not the pronouns, yeah. <laughs> Deborah Depressor, what are your pronouns? Pretty easy to remember, huh? Since it's all the way at the end here. Um. Yeah, you get the room in the questions? back. Um, what's the contract for? Yeah, so, you know, your little custodian was like, you should sign this. Huh? Contract? What are you talking about? Yukari doesn't seem to know what I'm talking about. <laughs> what? Uh, can I ask you something? Um, yes, it's natural. And yes, the carpet does match the drapes. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, I shouldn't have... <laughs> <laughs> this game's got me excited, guys. Can you tell? <sighs> well, okay. Don't worry about it then. I'd better get going. Yeah, get out of here, honey. Yeah, go go practice that gun, okay? Um, I'm sure you still have questions, but let's save them for later, okay? Good night. Good night, hon. Love you. First time talking to a new kid, and he starts telling you about his most recent psychotic break. He's like, <laughs> oh, God, oh, oh, it's so humble. Oh, OK, you know what? God, I hate to say it, but. Listen, yeah, Persona 3 Reload, it's cool and all. It's a glow up. Sure, that's what people keep saying, but <sighs> I don't know, guys. I think I got to give this game like a solid two out of ten because they. The furniture is like normal size now. That's that's kind of disappointing. Damn. I was really hoping to like this game, but if my furniture isn't like massive and stretched out and triple the size of me, what's the fucking point? You know what I'm saying? Ah, yeah, I guess I'll just squeeze in this little closet of a bed. Sure. Saving your game. Bad. All right. Rewinding to previous points. OK, there we go. Oh, OK. Hold on. Ooh, actually, new things. I have to. Okay, I can't just glaze over that this is actual or right, reminding to a, oh oh this is the new thing oh I forgot about this that's right they baby proofed Persona Three Reload so re <laughs> I actually don't mind things like that okay here's my stance on like the difficulty thing in a Persona game where it's like 
literally the journey is the whole point. It's supposed to be an investment of time and like the overarching story. The difficulty or like the punishment of Persona, I think is completely secondary, is besides the point, does not matter. Having features like this is nice to kind of cater your own playthrough. Um, and uh, when you save your game, it also it saves a little bit of your past. You can go back the time by opening the menu and going to the systems and selecting rewind. When you select the rewind slot, you can be, uh, it'll be returned to a point where you could roam freely shortly before your saved game. Note that the rewind feature does not save your new setting, your new starting point automatically. If you use this function, make sure you continue to save your game as necessary. So this is like a basically if you did a little oopsie oopsie fucky wucky and you want to like, you know, uh, redo a, a social link conversation or something like that. Um, but yeah, I'm one of those I'm one of those folks where it's like the difficulty of Persona is fun. Don't get it wrong, but like playing it on Merciless or like easy, I feel like you're gonna get the same experience for the most part. <laughs> That's kind of the whole point. So uh, you can check tutorials. Thanks, babe. Oh wow, humble beginnings. Oh, it's so much smaller in here. <laughs> oh god, it's normal size. It's to proportion. <laughs> Don't even have that giant closet behind the bed zero out of ten. That's not my beautiful bed wife. It's like, who the fuck are you? <laughs> that bed's just like me for reals. Oh my god. All right. Now that we're, let's actually save and then let's go back and watch the opening real fast, shall we? Danny Depresso, thank you. All right. Um, let's see. Many of thank you. Oh! 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 I just got smacked. Oh my god. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh. Wow. Let's do that one more time in slow motion, shall we? Ooh. Ah! Style! Wow. <laughs> That's what good pussy sounds like. <laughs> Oh, gosh. So with, I, there, I was reading some interviews talking about, like, um, the same person who was in charge of the UI and menu, menuing for P5 was also on this game, as you can tell. Um, and they made it, like, a full priority. And I'm, I'm so glad they did. All right, we can't access any of this shit, but I'm just happy to see the water. So I love this new aquatic thing going on because, like, the moon controls the tides. It, it works really well. It's a, it's, it's a look. It's thematically correct. It's blue. What's not to love? All right, let's go back to the title down. Let's watch the opening. Oh, there's the rewind. Okay, cool. Oh, there he is. Oh, he's falling. Aww. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, this is so great. Oh, he's bobbing in the water. So he's a water sign. Burn my dread more like dip me wet. <laughs> Let's go dip some wetness now. All right, you'll lose all pride. I just saved mama. I'm fine. Yeah, drowning in depression. The weight of the water of the world. Help, my son, he's drowning. He can't swim. All right, now let's wait. Now we wait. Is it credits or is it actually, is it, hold on, L? Oh, nope, that's Sega. <laughs> I know who made the, we're fine. All right, now we wait. How we all doing? Can't click count, so you know, what's going on? What's hanging? Again, Blitz, I want to say thank you so much for being the top, everybody, for, for the donos. Got Thank you guys for busting me. You guys are great. We beat the game! We did it! Great job, team! We, we took the biggest depression nap ever, and we won, so... I love when the dev team cares about the UI. Such an underrated focus that can add so much to the game. Well, P5 kind of... I mean, like, we know this. Persona 5, style-wise, like, the UI, the general aesthetics of it were immaculate. It was one of the key reasons why the game did so well, or at the very least got a lot of attention from new people because it looks so it looks so pretty. Um, and, you know, with Reload, we knew they were going to go for, you know, definitely more heightened aesthetics. Um, and it's so nice to see that they're keeping that, that eye poppiness, you know, the attention, the detail, like the UI person that they have is not a secondary position. It's like, that's their whole job is just to do that. Um, and they knocked it out of the park with this as well. Uh, so Dorkoon has time powers on top of his persona. Talk about OP. He's a smidgen overpowered. Mr. Big Shot, thank you for the hundred bitties. <laughs> so we use the power of Dork. Uh, did you play the Rebirth demo? No, I actually have no intention of playing anything, uh, no, none of the Rebirth demos. I know there's like, there's like two of them or something. Um, but, uh, I'm not looking or playing anything Rebirth related until the game comes out. I'm good. I don't need to be teased on that game. I just, ooh, everyone shut up. Here we go. Anyway, yeah, Persona 3. Like, I actually, I have not seen this at all yet. I, I know they posted this, uh, prior to the game coming out, but I didn't watch it. <gasps> Hello? <gasps> oh! No, no, go back to the first one! 
Ooh, I haven't heard this yet. <gasps> oh, I'm bumping. Oh, this reminds me of the reincarnation remixes. Oh, there she goes. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> That's really good imagery. <laughs> there she Oh god. I love the little underlining hum of suicide ideation or suicidal ideation in this. Boom, baby! Oh, there's the juice! Oh, nice. Ah, it's a good song, but nothing's ever going to top Burn My Dread for me. God, what a sick design. This is a really great opening, though. Oh, look at that. The crying moon. How you doing, I guess? My favorite toaster. Yeah, it feels like the FES opening more. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, that's hot. Wicked sick. Now that's hot. I also love how they kept the original logo for the most part. You know, kind of like the blockiness of it. Oh, that was good. That was good. I like that solid. Very pretty. Still burn my, burn my dread though. Built different. <laughs> Yeah, the imagery is on Burn My Dread levels of and so no, it's fantastic. Fan I would say that, like the music is a little more like um obviously Lotus Juice in there is always like a key fee. Like if Lotus Juice isn't in the track, it's not Persona 3, that's just how I feel. Um but uh some of it was like a little more reminiscent of like P4 to an extent, like a little combo of the two. All right, let's keep it going then. That was nice. I'm glad I saved that for myself. Seventy percent, seventy-five percent of the people playing this don't know what object he threw at the end of it. What the MP3 player? It's true though. Are you back? Yeah. How you doing? Uh, we're everybody's. Michael said I need to get a haircut before I go to sushi. So. Oh, you're getting a haircut? No, Michael's getting a haircut. Oh, Michael's so getting a haircut. So we have oh, to he's wait. a guy. Yeah. yeah we have to <laughs> I was wait like. Until hella late. Oh, okay. What are you doing right now? Uh, we just what what went back and just watched the opening because I didn't play it initially. Go go to the station. We already did. No, oh, just go to the station. Oh, right I now. can go back. Oh, oh, you just played the opening. I just, I just played oh, the opening. I was going to do a little bit. No, 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 no. I Here just got home. <gasps> you got me coffee! You're oh, from the, from the vending machine. machine. And I was oh! going to go to the vending machine and then bring that What out. the? Oh, my. What? Anya got me, like, one of those little tin can coffees that is you get your, from, like. your favorite from, from, vending from, machine. Oh, thank you, Bumby. He loves she me. Was, she was addicted to the in Japan. UCC cafe lattes, and I saw it at Daiso. They came out hot in the well, vending I'm machines. I'm sorry, these ones came out cold. We were so. there in winter. Also, Marty Time Stepper, how you doing, babe? Thank you so much for that gift sub. Thank you. I hope you're doing well. Great to have you again. Oh. Hope you're doing fantastic. Um, they're so good. <laughs> she loved me. Thank you, Bumby. Yeah, I was, I thought it would be funny if I'd be like, okay, go to the vending this, machine. Ooh. And then when you go to the vending machine, I put it on your desk. Yeah, here we go. Hold on. There we go. Well, here, 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 here. Because knowing me, I'd be like, all right, I, I just grabbed it from the, ooh, check my fridge. Your fridge, there's nothing particular that I want to chill right now, except this coffee that I'm drinking. Here we go. Clink, clink, everybody. <laughs> See? Every day. Oh, that be was like, good. She'd be like, Bobby, do you have 140 yen, please? And I'd be like, Yes, wife. I got better. I got better at counting the coins and stuff. So, yeah, in Japan, um, you know, there's an abundance of vending machines, um, but uh, most, if not all of them, that have like standard drinks, they have uh, hot, hot drinks as well. So you can get, you know, the vending machine will have like Coke, which comes out cold. But if it's like a, if it's got like a red glow on the button, uh, they come out hot. So like, you know, and we were there in winter and it was fucking cold. So I would get hot coffees for like a dollar and they're all, oh God, I miss it. When I saw it, I was like, <gasps> I gotta get it. Thank you, Bum. Welcome. All right. All right. Now we got the the adventures of Deborah of Depresso. Or not Deborah. De Danny Depresso. Excuse me. All right. 
Check the closet. All right, yeah, let's examine the room. Let's get, let's get down to business. Let's see what the fuck's going on here. Mirror, my reflection looks tired. You mean I look tired? Fucking. <laughs> All right, let's see what's in the closet. <gasps> the DLC closet. Oh my God. <laughs> Purchase DLC can be redeemed. Purchase DLC? Hmm. As an Atlas fan enjoyer, I have this instinctual need to purchase some DLC costumes right now. If you go to... Oh, yeah, by the way, I have to disclose this. Um, f oh. I have to put this in the, the description. Uh, just so the FTC doesn't sue me or whatever. Uh, for the record, fellas, this is the title of the stream. This is Go Figure, but for the VOD. Uh, thank you, Atlas, for providing the copy of today's stream. This is not a sponsored stream, per se, but they did give me a key to the game. Uh, so, you know, thank you, Atlas, for providing the copy of the game. Please, FTC, do not sue me. This is this is not fake advertising. All right, I actually do want to play this, though. I just got the game for free. Thanks. Thank you, Atlas. You're very cool. I didn't have to sign anything for it, but I did have to say, like, you have to disclose that it's a copy that they gave you. <laughs> yeah, that's sponsored with a lowercase s, exactly. I'm tired. I'll try watching. Okay. Uh, but I want to be a gamer. All right, let's go to bed, guys. Let's go to bed in this fucking shrimp-ass small mattress. Go on to sleep. Go the fuck to sleep, babe. It's a motherfucking Tuesday. It's Takeba. Are you awake? They forgot to give you a key to his closet. There we go. <laughs> yeah, no, no DLC costumes. Uh, just, just basic, basic game on Steam. This is a PC version. Oh yeah, I probably like. I think that's kind of go figure. We're playing the PC version. All right. Good morning, hun. Good morning. Did you sleep? <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, out of all of the P5 cast, Kemi would probably fit so snug in this game. Like, li she literally looks like she fits in. You know what I'm saying? She looks like this P3 spatterette into the P5 world. Um, so I might have thank you for the 100. And I agree, one vote. Ah. Uh, oh, this is nostalgic. Oh, this is nice. Yeah, this is, this is a subtle. It's cleaner, though. Oh, this is so weird. It's so surreal doing this, and it's, like, so much prettier. Like, it, it's, you know... This is, like, going back to, like, falling back asleep and, and going back to, like, the same dream that you've had years ago, but now it's, like, an HD. You know what I'm saying? Like, everything is so familiar, but it's so, like, much more clean and vibrant. It's it's kind of hard to perceive. Great. Let's head out. Is, is the DLC ad been avoiding info on P3 like the plague? It's just costumes right now, so. I uh. honestly love the ride here. It almost feels like we're flying. Get on that cheap public transportation, kiddos. You don't realize how lucky you got it. Stop on this line. It's called Tatsumi Port Island. Yeah. Have you heard of it? Welcome to Rich Kids Island Zone. Smack dab in the middle. Yeah, there we go. Oh look, there it is now. Ooh, there's the water. Ooh, so clean, so blue. Morning. You think they pay for it? Yeah, like two dollars a day or something like that. Allow me to welcome you to Gekko High School. Oh my School. God, 2009 Punk Day is something I didn't realize. I know. Zelly, she would work here well here, wouldn't you? Don't you think? I think I think we need like a little, you know. You'll be okay on your own from here, right? A little shady doctor on the side who's giving us drugs. Like, I feel like that's something that they could do. Where is she? Get her, someone call her and get her out here. She would do, she would do a killing. A doctor with a bunch of teenagers running around with apathy syndrome? She'd be popping pillies left and right. Prescriptions for days. You actually unlock someone like that. Well, if it ain't a hot goth doctor, I don't want it. No, it's okay. I guess you should go see your homeroom teacher first. My go-to um, social links in this one, I think it was like Kanji or something. Like the creepy kid who wants to date his teacher. Uh, Yoko, obviously. And then uh, I always did the, um, my, the, the, the gamer teacher social link. Absolutely love that one. Uh, I always max her out. So we're gonna be, we're gonna be hitting her up. We're gonna be spending all day online. Kenji, thank you. I can't remember his name. 
Oh shit, blueprints are thinking for the turn. Also, we will be an 11 out of 10 if the developers won't cowards and let us take the goat BB or just let us crunch Kenji. <laughs> but hey, it's on PC now. Modders, do your thing. We can make it happen. Blue Princess, thank you for the t thank you for the sandwich money on that. You're very kind. Um, and I'm glad you've been enjoying it. I'm super psyched. That let's say, let's get going. Let's get into the thick of it. The office is over there on the left. We'll tell you more when you get there. Oh, that about does it. Any questions before I go? Yeah, where's that gun? Are you? What classes are you in? Hmm. Me? I don't know. I haven't looked at the classroom assignments yet. All the social link cutscenes are fully voice, uh, which is awesome. That's true. Um, and uh, that is like that's one thing about this game different from the others. In this case, is that production-wise, um, yeah, all of the all of the social links are now fully voiced, which is crazy. It's a lot of voice work, and for me. That is a huge fucking uh, plus, 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 plus. I wonder, like, because again, I know Atlas has seen my videos. Um, one of the things that I mentioned in my Nocturne review from like several years ago that I know they watched, um, they, uh, I did mention in the past, I was like, I like Persona uh, story wise because the majority of it is voiced over. Um, and for me personally, when it comes to the social links, I've always had a difficult time like getting attached or like, you know, paying attention to the uh smaller nuances of the conversations with the social links like i get the i get the gist but i do plow through the dialogue because for the most part they're not voiced it's only voiced for like very specific scenes or something like that but for the majority of it it's not voiced so i would plow through the conversations because reading makes me tired um i do wonder if like hey atlas i don't know what decision this was but if it was specifically for me because i've mentioned this offhand thank you you're so cool for that uh <laughs> Because that's a big difference for me. If it's fully voiced, that means I can get more invested in the actual character. So I think I'm going to like the social links a lot more this time around. Last night. Don't tell anyone what you saw. Yeah, it's like, I am not reading. I am skimming at best. Exactly. And that's one of the re reasons why I've never gotten too terribly invested in a lot of the social links. Outside of just like, you know, he he funny person I hang out with for, for perks, you know? Um... Mm. Yeah, <laughs> you and uh, you didn't, and your dyslexia. It makes me sleepy. It makes me very sleepy. Um, how does it feel that Atlas watches your video? I mean, it's nice that Atlas acknowledges me, um, and uh, like their direct marketing, you know, is in communication with me and stuff. Atlas at the at least Atlas West. I can't talk about Atlas East because I have no clue. But Atlas West, at the very least. Um, they, they are very invested and involved in what the fandom is saying and who, like, you know, fandom people are. Um, so kudos to them for, like, paying attention to, like, the majority, you know, they're, like, the, what people are saying and talking about and, uh, doing a lot of, I guess, like, grassroots support. Um, one big shout out as well. Uh, Atlas sent me the Persona. Funny enough, it didn't come with the game, a copy of the game. I, I got the digital key. Um, but they sent me a uh, box, a massive Persona 3 reload uh, merchandise box along me when, along with a bunch of other creators. It was kind of like a thing that they sent out to a bunch of people. And this thing was fucking massive. Um, if you guys want to see it, there's a picture of it on my Twitter. Uh, and it came with a Persona 3 reload backpack. Lunchbox, pencil case, notebook, um, keychain, and then a pair of Sony headphones, which were like two hundred plus dollars, which also had P3, um, which is the nicest thing. This is the and I'm like I don't do a lot of like I didn't even have to sign anything for it either. They just had like, hey, do you want this? And I'm like, sure. So they just sent it, no strings attached, um, and uh, it was just a gift. Uh, and uh, yeah, shout Atlas folks. Thank you guys for involving the community and the folks like me, or at least like acknowledging that my content has brought people into the fandom. That really makes me happy. And yeah, shout out to Atlas for um, actually having like real life people in their marketing that pay attention to what fandom people are doing. <laughs> that makes me really happy. And clearly like they're listening as well because this wouldn't have happened if they weren't listening to people constantly demanding a remake for P3. You know, you know what I'm saying? Um, <laughs> yeah, Atlas trying to be kind of gay, people find- I've heard good things about, like, okay, the beginning of the game had the fucking rainbow sticker. <laughs> they do be listening, though. They do be listening. 
All right, looking around, focus on uh, viewing closer the protagonists, reset your camera and same locations. The camera will be locked in one place. Whenever it's available, using the camera will help you to get to a sense of your environment. Fantastic, okay. All right, hey, girly pops. All right, great, I have the worst teacher ever. All right now we can, oh shit, hey, hold on, these are, okay, <gasps> there he is! We can't, we can't social link him just yet. Let's see, is he being creepy here too? Class <gasps> F, huh? Oh my God, his voice. Homeroom teacher is what? Miss Toriyumi. Yeah, that's kind of like the little nasally Delulu voice I would expect from him. I guess she is older than me. Oh no, it's starting. I was hoping to be with Miss Kano. <laughs> she's like, hmm. I wonder if she's a cougar. There's no need for them to post names of the kids who are going to be in our class. I mean, we'll never see them again after we graduate anyways. <gasps> oh, hey! Hey! <gasps> why are you wearing a jersey? Oh, this is nuts. Uh, what do you mean, why? We've got practice after class, remember? Well, we've got to attend the opening ceremony and go to class before all that. Hurry and head into your classroom so you can change into your normal uniform. What? But I just... Okay. You okay. I know! I know you said... Oh, God, it's so crazy. Because I always did her social link. I, I like hanging out with her the most, but now that she's like fully voice, I'm like, I'm catching feelings. I'm catching feelings. The bulletin board with all the class assignments. It's literally right there, cause you're in class F. Oh, I love her. Different homeroom, so I can't keep an eye on you all the time. You got that? And she's talking stern. Mm, she's great. I like her. Oh, hell yeah. Also, Dolphin, thank you for the 100 biddy saying, remember, folks, if you want Persona 4 Remake, just scream about it loud enough. And it'll Truly, though, that is the catch. Like, so that's why I always tell people, it's like asking for things, be like, oh, that's never gonna happen. If we bitch and moan enough, it might. Truly, they're listening. Also, Anonymous, thank you for the 10. Also, Mr. Big Shot with 100 biddies, look at that sec. Same anonymous. Oh, thank you. With another sandwich. Another sandwich. How do you feel about the voices so far? I love them, especially the- Anonymous, thank you so much for the 10. Again, once again, bless me with some sandwich. Um, also for the voices, I, I already mentioned, like from what I've heard, at least from promotional material, some of them are different, um, but capture the spirit of the character, the essence or the cadence of the character really well. Um, and others are like really spot on, like Mitsuru's is like spot on. I know Junpei and Akihiko's are a little different, but tonally I feel like they're, they're, they're matching with the character's vibe. Um, and the fact that like, this is nice. I like her a lot. She's she's really everything just pops more in this, you know. I don't know. I feel like P4 doesn't need a remake. Like P3 needed it. I, yeah, I think it's because like P4 Golden exists, which again, which is like the equivalent of P3P. You know, in the case of like re-releases, it's the second attempt. I don't particularly think P4 needs it that much either. But visually, it's it's one of those cases where. If people will buy it clearly, and then also like to have Persona 3, 4, and 5 all on the same visual like line base point would be uh is what people really want. Baby, hold on, where? Hold on. Huh? Strange. They even made sure to check the map, but where am I? Where the fuck here is on this day? Hold on. You now listen closely. A true man should always carry the fiery soul of a samurai within them. Our school curriculum nurtures the samurai spirit within our students so that they contribute yeah, to- Even the teachers have VIs on, this is crazy. Oh la la, a wonderful. Oh, we. Oui. set my soul on fire and learn the ways of the great samurai also. Oh my god, we. Oui. <laughs> I don't think I've ever hung out with them before. That's what I like to hear, my boy. Though you hail from a foreign land, the samurai spirit. Oh, guys, it's get, it's same. getting a little. Uh... <laughs> where the hell is my, my fucking? Oh, where is it? Oh, it got, we have the French in here. We gotta have the French. Where's my? Huh. There it is. It, uh... A fascinating story. It brings eyes to my tears. <laughs> you really said, although you uh, gave your other one. <laughs> Sorry, get distracted. Zombie Barry, thank you for the 21. Welcome back. Welcome back. We got a wee wee. We be. All right. We'll talk to you later, handsome. All right. Yeah. Keep those wrists nice and limp for us. Okay. We'll be back. 
Also, what's the what's with the bread icon on here? What the hell is this? The bakery? Kids these days don't know how to show respect to their elders. We're we're their teachers. We've lived longer than them. All right, but her friends pulled out on me in the very beginning of the term. I'm sorry to interrupt. I need to get back to managing the shop. Even you're shooing me away some way to start the school year. Oh, oh, bother. The nerve. He's going through it. Kids these days, am I right? It's your John Boomer. You want me to order more of those cream-filled breads you like so much? Oh, my. Oh, my. You could have just asked. This man want <laughs> He's got it on lock for the cream breads. The nerve. The cheek, the gall. <laughs> All right, let's go to class. Let's go to fucking class. I know there's so much like smaller details to explore, but we have a whole game to go through, guys. So let's get our foot in the door. Let's actually, I want to, I want to figure out what the fuck's wrong with our school. Hold on. But the faculty, oh yeah, I got, that's right. I got to go talk to my teacher and she's be like, oh, hi. Oh my God, exchange student and blah, 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 blah. It looks here on your file that your parents died. Oh, just kidding. All right. Enter. Hmm. <laughs> Smells like gamer in here. Are you the new student? Huh. Damn Brad all soon. <laughs> hmm. You're a second year, correct? Wow, you've lived in a lot of different places. Let's see, ten years ago, your parents... So I just want like the dramatic attention of like, oh, your parents. Oh, your parents. Sorry. <laughs> sorry. Uh, I've been so busy. I didn't have time to read this beforehand. I miss you. <laughs> it's like it's just, just dead you. awkward silence. Welcome to our school. Uh, thanks. Yeah, it was tragic. I'm still, I, I, I still have PTSD. That's my class. But first we need to go to the auditorium. The welcoming ceremony will be starting soon. Come on, I'll show you the way. Why you look like Yukari's mom? She really do be looking like Yukari's mom, you're right. And so, another new school year is upon us. I'd like each of you- Oh my god! Oh my god! I love- The job's <laughs> worth doing, it's worth doing well. Um, this is- what a principal look. I love his- This means- I love his little mustache, he's so cute. Whisper, 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 whisper. That principal. That man does not have a single fucking thought in his head. Like, like this, this is like a puppet principal. Mitsuru is literally the principal behind the scenes. Pretending to be a student because she's 25. Right? I saw you two walking together. You must be pretty close, huh? Yeah, we're, we're totally dating. Between you and her. Oh. And, uh, does she have a boyfriend? <laughs> Nobody seems to know. Oh my god. She does. <laughs> I mean, why wouldn't she, right? Wait, how close are you guys? <laughs> well, we sleep in the same building, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> okay. Who's that? Someone's talking. Is that Joker? Per is that Joker Persona Five? Is that his voice? Is that his voice actor? Oh my God, Joker Persona Five. <laughs> wow! Incredible new record. Or rather, that's also Joker Persona Five. Yeah, sounds like it's coming from Miss Toriyumi's class. Hey, shh. Be quiet. Got the fucking You're whisper squad out here. What's up, dude? Oh, Bonds, you playing P3 for the first time? Mind if I play along with you? Go for it. Don't look at me We're in this together. Oh my god. And you are. It's Ace Defective. And also, stupid little. Them. <laughs> and you are? Me? Call me Junpei. Junpei Yuri. I transferred here when I was a second year in middle school. It's pretty tough being the Hey, Stupei. So I just. <laughs> hey. See what a nice guy I am? I actually love Junpei a lot. Out of like, out of like the, si the side bros, I think Ryuji's still like top boy. Uh, but I put kind of like Ryuji, Junpei, and then Yosuke. Um, just because, you know, I, Junpei for me is funny because he's clearly trying to be a, a fuckboy, 
Like he wants to be a fuck boy, but he's he's too sweet. He's he's got too good of a heart for it. And uh, and I you know I love that uh, him what him and uh, Tioria like end up having in the end. He's so sweet. He's very sweet. Hey, it's Yukata. I love his you know peas for brain fuck boy persona. Didn't think we'd be in the same class again. He's a massive coomer. <laughs> Stop. He is. He's so fucking. <laughs> I would dare I say he's gooning a little bit. Uh, <laughs> there you go again. Big of heart, okay. dump of ass, absolutely. Try not to make him uncomfortable, okay? Too late. What? I was just being friendly. If you say so. He's already tried to sell me weed, you car. I get him. Anyway, who'd have thought we'd be in the same homeroom? Yeah, I know. Crazy. <laughs> Funny, huh? Ah, <laughs> look at us having fun. Hello? Are you forgetting I'm in this class too? Anyway, I gotta ask. I heard you guys walk to school together. What's up with that? Come on, give me the dirt. What's up with that? What are you talking about? We just happen to live in the same dorm. Why do people always jump to conclusions? I showed him my gun last night though. That was fun. About this already? Now I'm worried. Hey. Hey, I'ma just say, man redeems himself just enough to earn a spot at my team against the final. Oh, that's cute. I can't remember. I think like when I, first time I beat P3, I think I had, funny enough, I had Ken. I was like, Ken, Mitsuru, and I guess? I think that was my combo. You know, the, the real MVPs out here. This voice acting I love, it's very clean. You didn't tell anyone about you know what, did you? What, your massive gun? Your Glock? Seriously, like don't say anything about last night, okay? Yeah, Yosuke. <laughs> What's that like picture where it's like, you know, harmless flirting and then like sexual harassment? That's the difference between like Jimpei and Ryuji and then Yosuke. <laughs> That's the difference. What? This fucking night. last night. Oh my god, the fucking minute, Don't get the wrong idea. Listen, I just met him yesterday, and there is absolutely nothing between us. Well, except this chair. I have to go now. There's something I need to take care of for the archery team. You better not start any more rumors. Yeah, what is this? Persona 2? No rumors. Get out of here. Who cares? No one takes rumors seriously anyway. <laughs> so paranoid. But hey, it's your first day here, and people are already talking about you. Believe it or not, she's actually pretty popular. You're the man. Thanks, bro. High five. Here's to a fun school year, dude. Oh. You're ready to head out. We can walk to the station together. Yo. All right, take a run to the school. Just follow you around. If you want to leave, head for the front entrance. Yeah. Uh, I don't remember Yosuke getting so much hate. Tell me. Ooh, boop, 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 boop. Played again for two. Uh, forgot to say Velo L -R -I -P. Oh, oh Star! Oh no! I was I clicked out of the game. Uh, played out. You two, played again for two hours and forgot to. No! Oh man, remind me to save too. Star, thank you for the hundred. So sorry about your loss. Uh, let's see. Turquoise said, Star, thank you for the 21. Thank you, thank you, saying, I think it's the only time I cannot be angry when being told burn my bread. This game has the potential to be game of the year for me. I, see, it seems like it's really grabbing, folks. I'm excited. Uh, thank you for the 21. Also, I don't remember Yosuke, uh, getting so much hate, uh, uh, in the past. Then again, P4's reputation has gone down in recent years. Oh, I like Yosuke. I think he's funny. He's just like, he's the most desperate out of the side boys. You know what I'm saying? Like his, and also he's he's incredibly insecure and it's funny. He's probably the funniest in the sense that he's like, you know, constantly going like, no homo and like, hey girls, get naked. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, uh, actually, here, here, I have a sound. Yos <laughs> Yosuke is literally just, uh. You can't cook? You won't get naked? What are you even good for? He's, he's all him. Perf perfect in his own way. Yeah. All right. If you're trying to leave, you have to go to the floor. Okay. Yeah. yeah I'm not trying to leave. I'm here to do class. You're the new kid. You have no idea how lucky you are. 
You're surrounded by cute girls in 2F. Oh my god. Don't you feel like completely lost whenever you transfer to a new school? This is the second floor and the one- Yeah, okay, it's a- No, I'm not lost. I know where the fuck I am. Alright, this is- This is deja vu. Okay, now what? Alright, return to the dorm. School's over. Do I chit-chat with everybody? Hmm. You're gonna join it. I'm planning to, yeah. Well, I joined the one with the cute track girl. Keep an eye on open spot. All right, they start in April. All right, new school years sure are rough. New teachers, new classmates is exhausting having to start over every year. Womp womp. All right, let's go home. Go. Let's get addle. Check the roof. Okay, go to the dorm. I can't. I can't do like the teleport thing just yet. Hello, boys. Oh, it's you. Leon, they were the hundred. Yeah, they're remaking Persona 4 apparently again. I feel like the voice cast is getting way more iconic in the game. Oh, no, the bot's getting it. Uh, then three, so we'll have to see. Lord knows half the P4 cast hasn't been recast enough. I, I don't know what a P4 remake would look like. I, I'm not very eager for it either because I still think Golden is still fantastic. It's really just a visual element, you know what I'm saying? Is that, you know, Persona 4 Golden, despite like all of its improvements from the original, still looks like a PS2 game, you know, and uh, at the very least these don't. So like that's the only benefit I can see from it, but I'd still rather just get a P6 over a 4 remake at this point. If they have to prioritize one over the other, I'd rather get a P6. So. You think so? Oh, oh, I oh, him. That's right, okay, hi. Oh, nice. All right, gotta get, okay, yeah. Bye, bye gossip girlies. Let's go to the roof, yeah. Gotta use the stairs on the other side. Whoops, it is. Would you say Persona 4 Golden is golden? I would say, actually, yes. All right. <gasps> Fuka! PK, thank you for the hundred. Thank you, thank you again. Thank you for the blessings on top of everything else. Uh, for the love of God, let Yosuke be gay. Uh, it's at least they can give him some content. Well, there was like, didn't they? I don't know how true this is and stuff. I've heard several mixed things. But um, yeah, that's the thing is that Yosuke's social link in particular works way better as like a general character arc if you get homo, you know, with uh, with the with the pro tag and also Kipo is sitting in my lap now. Um, and wasn't there like cut dialogue where that was at one point an option and they backed out at the last second? So yeah, if there's one thing that they could do about P4, it would be that is because his entire arc revolves around him being like, really insecure, no homo, like, you know, like, ooh, gay people, ooh, you know, and then at the end, you know, he softens up around, you know, his best friend and that kind of thing. And, uh, you know, and then eventually it comes full circle and he stops to, to <laughs> stops being that way. You know what I'm saying? His prejudices come down. Um, so the unofficial waifu we ward for <laughs> fucking warning shot. <laughs> but I hate his acknowledgement of his bad behavior towards Kanji is put in a side conversation. Ah, uh, yeah, you see, it's like they, they he has like a half-baked character arc because they seem, for whatever reason, they like pulled their punch at the last second and then just like watered it down. So yeah, that's like, there's a handful of things I could see in a P4 remake that would benefit it. Anyway, let's try to convince Fuka not to jump. Honey, no, your cooking isn't that bad. <sighs> I'm going to be a second year. <sighs> It sure is hard being Fuka, thinking Fuka thoughts. I hope I can fit with my new class. God, I sure hope I don't get fucking mean girl bullied so bad I get stuck inside the school and when it turns into a hell contraption, that would suck. Oh my god, Fuka, honey. All right, let's get out of here, let's go home. I got a little Junpei sign kick. You can't go down the, what the? What? We getting one-way doors in my Persona 3 Reload? What is this, Nocturne? Get me out of here. <laughs> Credits roll, that's it. We're just stuck on the roof. <laughs> it's like, well, we can't get down the stairs. Let's go the old way. And we just throw ourselves. Kipo, what? Oh my gosh. Right, hold on, guys. All right, Kipo wants pets. She's like in my lap going back and forth. She needs this right now. All right, keep it. No, keep it. Come on. No, no, no. Get off, sweetie. When his whole is about how like, things doesn't make you gay. And I thank you for the hundred biddies. Uh, 
The Uzio's case almost is proof that Alice was too scared to make get, uh, Kenji J, uh, gay when his whole arc is about how liking feminine things doesn't make it. Which is true. Yeah, to be fair, yeah, um, uh, uh, Kanji's, um, I said Kanji, Kanji's uh, social link um, is about that, or at least like his ar character arc is about him embracing his interests and in that him liking feminine things is not indicative of his sexuality or doesn't dictate it and stuff. So it's like, you know, uh, Kanji's social link is all about how he deals with his own shame of like, you know, being perceived as different, right? Um, and obviously, you know, like, his dungeon is more about, like, his, his hidden feelings and blah, blah, blah. Like, you could read it as both, too, as Kanji being closeted, but it is more about him accepting himself as, as who he is and, like, the things that he enjoys. You know, because he's into textiles and, like, you know, making things and things that are not manly. And then, you know, Yosuke's, Yosuke's thing is, is kind of like he is homophobic now. <laughs> Um, yeah, there's a handful of things I'd like to see in P5, or P4, a P4 remake that I feel like they could generally improve upon. Um, but, uh, you know, and then some, but then some folks would say, at least with Kanji Social Link, is that, um, you know, at least stereotypically, Japan has a tendency of being like, oh, you're not gay, you just like feminine things, you know, in an attempt to kind of like, oh, gay people aren't real, you just like girly, you just want to be a woman or something like that, you know what I'm saying? So some folks would say that Kanji's character arc is slightly disappointing in the sense that it falls back on that trope of like, because again, Japan's, their interpretation of gay people is not so much like gay people bad. It's more that gay people aren't real. You're just confused. That's kind of how it, that's like normally how it pops out, um, at least when it comes to like subtle bigotry. I got not to get too deep into this stuff already. Um, but yeah, then again, there's just like, Either way, I feel like Yosuke's so sh like a uh, entire character arc could go full full, full, full circle because um, him being uncomfortable around people he thinks are gay is is a sticking point for him. You know what I'm saying? It's something that he like needs to get over. All right, let's go. Let's get out of here. Yeah, Japan, your sexuality is not valid. Yeah, that's that's normally how their bigotry pops out. Obviously, they've gotten a little better with it, you know, being like, okay, yeah, maybe these, like, people aren't, like, confused and just being silly and stupid and, like, again, being gay is, is maybe kind of real, I guess so. So that's kind of, like, how they're getting better with it, if that makes sense. It's a, like, it's a, it's a passive dismissive bigotry. That's the best way I can describe it, because, of course, it's very different, you know, how, how, um, again, you, you discredit your gaze depending on your location. <laughs> Yeah, gay people exist. I thought they were it was an agenda the liberals are pushing. <laughs> but also gender non-conforming people exist. I like Kanji having a, a love for feminine things and still being a straight man. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not saying it takes away from his arc or anything like that. Um, I'm more about like, because how I feel about it is I think it's perfectly fine. It's whatever. Um, but some people do see, we're disappointed in Kanji's case of hoping that they would go and be like, fully acknowledge like a gay person but instead it falls on the the wayside of like oh he's not gay he just likes girly things you know which some folks would say is a trope um again this is what other people have said though in my opinion i'm like whatever about it you know is the game is the game came out into the early 2010s i wasn't expecting atlas to be out there swinging i thought that what they had was enough at the time your stop city with todai right They've gotten a little better with it, though, especially over the last, you know, few years. Watch my Catherine video if you're curious what I think about these things. Yeah, baby steps. I'll take it. There was a rainbow sticker in the be or a button in the beginning. The game is saved. Hooray. <laughs> we did it, guys. All right. Oh, ooh. Ba 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 ba. I never felt that. Da 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 da. This song is so depressing in its lyrics, but you wouldn't be able to tell from the beat. <laughs> Literally starts with "I've never felt so miserable." <laughs> If you hold me tight. Sorry, we're dancing, guys. Anyway, let's go. Hello, small child. Everyone's excited because school's starting, but I don't really care. Now, that's a real one. 
Also, uh, Garrett, thank you so much for the five dollars earlier. I'm sorry I missed that. Thank you. Very yeah. kind. Uh, also, <laughs> random guy, thank you for gifting a sub to the gays. Gay. To the gays, everybody. We're obnoxious, but we that we do be doing art and creative things. That we make cool things sometimes. You'd be surprised, you know. You'd be surprised that your favorite piece of media or whatever was probably made by, you know, a little fruit behind the scenes. That's all I'm saying. All right, we're everywhere, whether you like it or not. Visible or not, we're in the waves. We're in the DNA. Thank you for a random guy for supporting the gays. All right. Hello, cop. Hello, officer. We received a call from this area. Is everything okay? Uh, not this again. This is the same as that weird syndrome being reported all over the news. Sir, he's clinically depressed. I don't care what apathy syndrome you have, all right? They're sad. They live in society. We do persist. We do be everywhere. Every way, shape, and form. Let's see, oh lord, thank you for the, t for the whole two years. Thank you for... Unstoppable. Hey, Buns, glad to catch a live stream. Congrats on that. Thank you. Thank you so much. Welcome back for keeping it going. All right. Got who the fuck is... Who's hungry? Who's fucking hungry? Oh my god, it's so packed. All right, we're going in. The mystery burger seems to be a popular ad. Maybe I should try. How about we try it now? I don't want to go home. Oh, all right, fine. Let's walk around. My friend has a cat and it's so cute. I'm not allowed to have one though. So I just try to get my fill of cats by looking at the street. I feel that. Me, me in Japan, missing my cats and going to the cat cafe. Wow, everyone's so chatty. It's so lively. Like I know they're doing like the, the faceless NPC P5 thing, but it just makes it feel so much more busy and real. Ah, uh, I remember the old school days and coming out here where there's just like fucking four guys standing around doing jack all. <gasps> the old people too, they're out here. Hey guys. Get some quality sushi close by. Drop by sometime if you want. Oh, actually our shop is still under renovation, sorry. We're a bookstore. Honey, we're a bookstore, not a sushi restaurant. I'm sorry, he's always like that. Oh. I also love these people. I always, I always social link them. Great shops here, swing by, work for now, but slacking off. Salarymen be like, I wanna go up, let me be free. Oh my God, oh shit, we can just go up the whole thing. Did it. Oh my God. Huh? Ah, there he is. Sorry, I'm busy trying to decide what to eat here. Should I go with the pork ramen or chase it with rice or perhaps, ooh, okay. Yeah, get the pork ramen, bro. <gasps> also, yeah, John Athleteman. Everyone's just hanging out. Oh my god. We're getting a glimpse into our future for all of our lovely friends. Yeah. Salad! Oh god. Let, let the man eat. It helps helps the economy. Hurts nobody. Except his waistline. But you know, that's beside the point. Oh my god. Seeds inside. If you hold... <gasps> Ooh. Oh, it's so pretty. I'm just gonna be saying, wow, it's so pretty, like the entire fucking playthrough. Visit as many spots as you can. Can we see, like, all the doodads? The info. Ooh, yeah! Yeah! Look at all this! Quality of life information! Oh, baby! Oh! Infor inform helpful, playful information. There we go. Oh, it looks so nice. All right, let's go to the dorm. I'm so glad they kept this. Everything. This is good. This is good. This. Mm. Good remake. Good remake. Over me. Hey, small child. There are all kinds of shops here. I have a delicious craving food. Uh, all right. Find desserts, burgers. She's, she's like, are you here to like sell me stuff? Magnify, enhance, Kowalski. Yeah, it tells you which social links are ready to rank up, which uh, uh, and which aren't awesome. Look, this is like what I was expecting the most out of this was taking a majority of the Persona 5 gameplay quality of life features, which again is just telling the player basic things or like giving quick buttons to certain, like speeding up tedious things or just letting you know so you don't have to like you know run over to the map. To do blah, blah, blah. Just just helpful little small adjustments that make the flow of the game way better. Um, and that was the one thing I was hoping to see in this game, uh, at least in the case of, like, additions, was adding those things, and apparently they've done it, so... Alright. Nice uniform you got there. 
Looks like Gecko Khan High went through a rough patch a while back, but it's been rebuilt in such a magnificent building. Uh, never mind me. Enjoy your new school semester this spring. Oh. Why? What did it, what it used to be, huh? It couldn't have been any... Oh, I'm sure it was nothing, you know? Like, they, are, you think they're just, like, renovating, like, secret government research facilities out here and turning them into high schools? I think that'd be fucking stupid, wouldn't you say? Shut I'm sure everything's fine. Hey, mama! <laughs> how was your first day at school? I love how she's talking to me like a concerned mother. Not too bad. I'm only slightly more depressed than normal. Yeah, nothing happened 10 years ago in the underground lab beneath the school. What the fuck you talking about? <laughs> yeah, don't be ridiculous. Hello, dorm mother. I don't mean to keep you here. It's a long day. You can get some rest. Sure hope none shenanigans happen. <gasps> oh, God. Ah! Ah! Wow. Ah! Just as flat and lifeless as I left it. Ah, incredible. <laughs> I saw some folks talking about, like, you should lower down the brightness a bit in the game just so that, like, the color contrast isn't so washed out in here because, like, true, you know how I know this is a faithful remake? Because look at this fucking place. Look at this thing. Look at the, look at the flatness of all of this. This, truly, they cared about the original game because they, they kept this, look at this way. Eat the Minecraft grass texture. Yeah, it sure does look like a renovated hotel lobby. It looks like the tipped it. Yeah, oh my god. What are you doing just looking around? You're probably pretty tired after your first hey, huh? Maybe you should go to bed earlier. I don't get it looks fine. Oh no, it like it looks literally like the original. I just saw some people being like how because it looks so much like the original, you know what I'm saying? Like, this looks something straight out of a PS2 game, and they didn't feel the need to, like, zhuzh it up or, like... You know what I'm saying? Like, go fucking crazy to the balls of the wall. It just looks like it does from 2000, you know, back in the back in the day on the PS2. It's kind of adorable, and everything else in this game is, like, so pretty and sexy. All right, she has a flip phone? Oh, my God. <gasps> Yukari, are you texting on your new Motorola Razor? That's the new- that's the latest and greatest phone. Holy shit. Not that nothing. Okay. So dance, if you wanna Can you see the room? By the way. So mind your own biz, whatever, like Besides, you must be tired. I am. I am tired. Yeah, you should walk me to bed. Alright, let's go to bed. Actually, before we do that, can we do can we still save here? Alright, zero out of ten. We can't save with a thing anymore. We have to do it. God, we have to do it through the menu. The, we have to do it the easier way. That's stupid. <laughs> yeah, Mitsuru, can you tuck me in? I'm a skid. Oh, here's the vending machine. There we go. Clank, clank. All right. I'm tired of telling me people have told me to go to bed. Yeah, instead of your cat doing it, it's like the entire dorm's just screaming at you. All right, time to squeeze into the shoebox. <gasps> I'm going out for a bit. Whoa! Good God, Aki Hiko. He's fucking. He's like lacing that protein with testosterone. Good Lord, just raw testosterone. Here, out of all of the voices so far, um, he definitely does sound like the most different, but I think it's like, the essence of it is still really good. Hmm? Have you seen the newspaper? Ooh, God, the vibrato. There's a lot going on. Yeah, he's he captures the tone of it no. great. Severe cases of apathy. Definitely like a little, like a lower octave, but that's, that's Akihiko. Yeah, his balls drop. Those things are dangling. I say it's due to stress, but... Sigma male Akihiko, he tr If you look up Sigma male, there's a picture of him. Truly, he's the most Sigma. Otherwise, it's not worth my time. And that's what makes him so damn sexy, that's the thing. You have a one-track mind. 
Will you be okay out there on your own? Don't worry. I'm just getting a little practice. <laughs> His balls are getting carpet burned! To him it is, it's practice. Are you kidding me? He gets his ribs cracked every other week. Do, 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 do. I can hear people talking. Have you heard? Talking shit! Hold up. That's old news. Besi I thought for some for a second I thought it was like besties. It's just a ghost story, not a rumor. You're talking about that one girl, right? The second year, she stopped coming to school and just sits around staring at walls all day. <laughs> what a vibe, me. Whenever her mom tries to talk to her, the only thing she says it's coming, it's coming. I'm sure she's fine. Has she tried like going for a walk and like drinking water? Clean your room, maybe. I don't know. That's really how the story goes. Whatever. It's probably all made up, anyways. Just get, take some vitamin D and you'll be fine. Yeah, the, the press mama's like, it's coming, it's coming. <laughs> okay, time for class. All right, open it up. Essay, okay, I remember some of this shit, so I, I know they've changed some of this, but... Like, again, this is- I, I don't pay attention in fucking real school you expect me to do in the video game? No, thank you. Danny, were you listening? I was not. You're on your own, Junpei. Alright, day-to-day life will come across. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Social link, social links. What phrase symbolizes summer? Uh, isn't there... Hmm... A rain of flowers. Alright, lemons, lemons! I don't... I know they've, they've changed most of these from my understanding, and I also don't remember any of the originals, so let's do it. She just said it. You think I'm reading? Thank you. Exactly. Yay! I actually was not going to pick that one. Thank you. Thank you, guys. All right. Yeah, I could have checked the log real fast, but I could... Why do that when I have all of these beautiful gamers who will tell me the answer in a heartbeat? Ha ha ha. a lifesaver. Pro tip stream on Twitch. He saved his bacon, and I'll save other things, too. depresso coon gave him the answer just now. He might have a good memory or something. Yeah, or a, a, a Twitch chat. <laughs> They're whispering, like, wow, he's so cool. Wow, he's really smart for pronouns and blue hair. Oh, the network. I was looking around for the network button, but I didn't see it. What's the network button? Because I assumed it was like, you know, because I turned on the network features, uh, and I guess similar to like P5 and 4. Um, but I didn't- I don't know, where's the button for it? Not available yet? Okay. I was like, yeah, where is it? Later, later? Alright. I guess we have to connect our phone to the Wi-Fi. <laughs> I never felt like... ...the miserable... They make you struggle first? Okay, yeah, we have to put those brain cells to work. Oh, he's back. Catch your name, him Depresso. Yeah, it's Danny Depresso. You know? So this is oh! Guest. oh! A man! Oh, God. I can't, again, for spoiler reasons, but also preemptive. Alright, turtleneck hippie Jesus. What do you want? Good evening. Good evening. Oh, he sounds... He sounds less aloof in this one. Um, but I can't tell if it's better or worse, because, like, him selling more aloof is... How about this? Out the gate, he's already... It's, he's, he's getting a little... He's a little stinky. You know what I'm saying? A little sussy. That's why I don't like introducing myself. Even I get tongue-tied sometimes. Oh yeah, he's like way more like... I guess he like kind of looks the part now or sounds like he... He sounds snooty. He sounds a little pretentious. Please, have a seat. Yeah, he sounds a bit more down to earth. Like he actually knows what he's doing. I apologize for the confusion regarding your accommodations. <laughs> I know what you are! Before you receive the proper yeah, he sounds more like he looks, which is like kind of nerdy, a little regal. You know what I'm saying? Is there anything you'd like Pompous. Alright, who else lives here? There are only four students in this dorm. 
you <laughs> for this whole fucking building. Everyone gets their own floor. And a third year named Akihiko Sanada. I'm just want to say this is not a prime use of real estate, but then again, I know that they all have us in here because we have the potential, you know. You all Do you have Yeah, this is this is for the freaks only dorm. No. <laughs> I have no questions. Here's to a wonderful school year. Now, if you'll excuse me. I am new to Persona 3, but I, even I had a feeling he's a bad guy in the AE. I won't say much, but yeah, his original voice acting was a little more aloof, a little more like, hello there, how are you doing, you know? And so he was a little more innocent. Um, this is immediately out the gate if you, like, just know how video games go and be like, I don't know if I can trust this guy. Say, the early bird catches the bookworm. <laughs> Get it? Bookworm? <laughs> because you're students? Uh. <laughs> you're fu you're so funny. You're so fucking. Don't kill yourself. Anyway, isn't it? Please die. <laughs> oh, uh, Kari's just like, oh god. Like the chairman said. Watch out, guys. Yukari's on life support from cringe. Is a real pain when you're not used to it. Good night. I should listen to him and rest in my room. Hello there. <laughs> so, how's he doing? Oh my god. I've... He went to bed a little while ago. He's currently fast. I want to, like, uh, here's, a, like, for me, this is just like taking a stroll down memory lane, but everything's prettier. But for some folks who have never played P3 before, I'm so envious of y'all because if you don't know, like, what's coming next, you're just being like, there's a fucking supercomputer from the 80s inside the dorm. Let me just, let me just log on to the main character cam out here, sleeping. Yeah, the stalking. Because, like, clearly you, you can tell from the get-go, like, shit's going weird. Yeah, we got Pharaohs, the Midnight Hour, Yukari's got a gun, and then it's just like, oh, okay. Mr. Here's, here's goddamn Mission Control. The big bad- in the- <laughs> with this angle, the big bad is back, you're so right. Just this angle, though. Well, let's wait and see for now. The dark hour is approaching. Come on, what do you say? I can't leave a pretty girl standing around in the cold like this. Mm, what do you think, my name is? I mean, I'm... I will say, as someone who has never played or even know any of the story from the original, it was a while, I'm so envious, because like, I would love to experience for this for the first time again. Uh, this sucks. Uh. I'm serious. I was scared yeah, shitless. Right. Nice story, though. That was the Bayside Rockers, brought to you by KJ. And that's all for tonight, folks. Yeah, Tune in again next week, same time, same place. <laughs> the program you just heard was sponsored by Curicho Electronics, bringing the future to you. Bringing the future to you today. Uh oh. Shut <laughs> the. Like, all right. I like this. I like this new little. There we go. Oh no! Oh, bro. See, this is what you get for being strong-willed. What the? What the? Uh. <laughs> Guys, don't you hate it when you're just like minding your own business, listening to the radio, and then suddenly you look up and everyone's turned into like giant red coffins? What's up with that? Oh my god. <laughs> Flap and blossom. What's that? Oh, he's gooping! To me? Oh my god, he's gooping into- Wow, are we actually seeing, like, visually what happens to the people left out? Like, is this- are we seeing apathy syndrome in real time? <laughs> oh god, he exploded into diarrhea! Moon, shine down. Yeah, he got goop smoothied. Hmm. He's still sleeping. All right, well, I guess inferred. He's got the runs. At twelve midnight, he's got that depression IBS. Hour. By the way, I counted the heart rate on the monitor in my playthrough, and damn, Depresso should be in the hospital. <laughs> it's so fast. <laughs> this time, an ordinary. So he's got he's got a bad case of high blood pressure. I guess that explains the. Uh... That occurs, so. Then he must be. 
I'll tell you what I'm really excited for is actually the gameplay, because I've heard the dungeon crawling and this is just so much better because of the improvements. But he's definitely experienced. Say, fellas! The dark hour? Say, fellas, did somebody mention the door to darkness? It's a leafy, thank you for the hundred. Uh, also, Phelan, thank you for the seven months uh, uh, earlier with a prime. So sorry I missed that. The only question that remains is whether or not he has the potential. Well, he's got high blood pressure, we know that much. He must. If he didn't, they would have preyed on him by now. So he would have dissolved into diarrhea by now. <laughs> In any case, we should continue to monitor him. What was it like in the original game? As in, uh, what was? Like the, uh, uh, like the, the, the scene or whatever, the person, like, gooping? They don't goop at all. Yes, it's just like, oh shit, he's out and about. kind of bad, though, spying on him like this. Oh! Oh, hell yeah. Oh, here we go. Yes, let the nose reach out. Um, fun fact, this is my favorite velvet room. Uh, just because an elevator going to nowhere. And it just keeps going and going and going. It's fucking sick. Love this place. Love this velvet room. Because it's, hey, it's also, hey, it, can, can you fucking believe it? to make your acquaintance. It's also... Because it's like climbing the top, you know, Tartarus. Hey, hey. Also, Igor, hi. This is I missed your voice. She's I guess it's new ish, huh? Like myself. Yeah, I miss you being like a weird little guy, you know what I'm saying? Hi, Elizabeth. Hi, sweetie. Pleased to meet you. Oh, she's way more perky. Way more upbeat. This exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. She's kind of, she's given a little head empty, you know? Little, yeah, kind of little dorkish, little goofy. Only those who have signed the contract can. Same VA? Oh shit. Well, new recording at the very least. From now on, you shall be welcome here as a guest in the Velvet Room. Thanks. You were destined to hone your unique ability, and you will require my assistance to do so. I only ask one thing in return. Abide by your contract and assume full responsibility for the choices you make. Again with this. What if I don't wanna? Okay, fine. Hold on to this. Until we meet again. <laughs> Here's your key, get out. <laughs> Just fall down the fucking shaft. <laughs> All right, there we go. Damn, I thought. Okay, well, he said, "When are we getting attacked?" I guess it's tomorrow or today. Uh, oh, is it? Is it the full moon? All right, here we go. Time to go to school. Oh, his little slippies are on. How cute. What color would P six be? I think P six is gonna be green. I feel like that's just kind of like go figure. Um, cause like Persona 1, it's either purple or green, and Persona 1 is kind of purplish, so... But then again, P2 is also kind of red, so it's like there's no rules saying they can't repeat previous colors. Um, but, uh, uh, conventional wisdom would say green. So... P2 colors now orange. P2 is white. Well, I mean, like, I got P2. Here's the thing. The whole color thing really didn't take off till three. That's the because it's like, yeah, like Persona had color, but the color motif being a consistent thing didn't really start until three. So like Persona 2 doesn't really have a quote unquote designated color. It just has the box and then like, you know, again, reoccurring things inside the game. Um, Persona 3 was the one that started the, the color motif and then P4 kept with it and stuff and then P5 cemented it. Um, so, you know, it's kind of like just an expectation now. But yeah, I would say conventional wisdom says green. Um, <clears throat> All right. right. Yeah, build up your courage. Be a baddie. Now, moving on. 
If it's green, I hope it's dark green. It will be a nice, yeah, nice regal dark green. Wouldn't that be nice? P6 with Fem MC and Female Romance entrance. It's I would take pink as well. I'd be surprised if it was pink. But I would take, well, I guess like Catherine's kind of the pink one, which I wouldn't say is like, again, it's not saying there's some rule for it, but um, if we're talking like the Atlas spread, Catherine is very much the pink game, <laughs> you know? Make it brown. I say, yeah, give it, give it that, give it that pump and brown. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Talkity talk, talk, talk. I feel sleep. Oh, that's right. Didn't they get rid of the sickness system in this, though? I, from my understanding, like, do the do the characters still get tired and tartarous? Like, do I still get like a cold if I'm like too too pro gamer? They did no fatigue. Then what's the point of this? Well, I guess it should like. Well, I guess like this only shows up like a handful of times on like the step. I'm staying awake. Mm. I ain't gonna get fatigued later. What's the so that's. <laughs> I'm paying attention, damn it. Oh, sleep gives courage. <laughs> if only that was real. Yeah, sure. Be like, ah, I'm feeling a little, little down, a little weak. I'm going to go take a nap and gain some courage in the process. You get courage instead from napping. Now that's now that's fantasy. That's how you know this is a, that's how you know this game ain't real. I have to have the balls to sleep in class. I was doing that shit no problem in high school. I didn't have the courage for it. I was just knocked out. I remember once I, I didn't sleep for like three days straight, uh, like freshman in high school, and I fell asleep in my history class on my backpack, and I woke up in like a pile of my own drool because I was out. I wonder what some of the conversations between the Velvet Room with all the siblings of that place after each game are. <laughs> Probably just like... <laughs> How much their fucking feet hurt from standing? That's what Dragon Warrior. Thank you for the hundred. Want to stop somewhere on the way home? Where? Are you taking me out? I don't know. Maybe grab a bite to eat. Yeah, d treat me to a duck burger, babe. That's right. You're new around here. No worries. I'll show you. It's I am manifesting a P6 of MMC. I think it is about time. It's a high demand thing. Mm. This is Polonia Mall. Yeah! Let's go! Whenever I hang out with the guys from school, we have there's a karaoke box, an arcade. Oh, yeah, you can rent out CDs, too. <gasps> For reals? And there's that club over there. Oh, my God. Not that I've ever gotten it myself. Plot twist. Junpei works at the club at night. Throwing it back. This place may not look like the memories have been unlocked. Oh, oh, there we go. We got a Jack Frost claw machine. Let's check out the CDs first. CDs! Ah, that's how you know this is a pre-2010s game. How do I know this is taking place in the early 2000s? They have CDs and MP3 players. I gotta try this. Let me show you my mad crane game skills. Oh god, oh god, he's gonna whack it. Damn it! <laughs> mad. Oh, come on, man. Aw, aw. I'm not leaving empty handed. Dude, I'm gonna look from the side. Yeah, that's it! Yo! One more try. Just one. I hung out with Junpei for a while before heading back to the dorm. Junpei is now in debt. Be the crane. I think it should stop being the crane, actually. I don't know. I don't know if it's working. And he's broke, yeah. And we have no money to get back home. Eh. You're pretty late. I don't mean to be overbearing, but please don't make this a regular occurrence. What are you, my mom? Because I sure hope so. All right, whatever you say. Well, in any case, you look quite tired. Why don't you go to bed early tonight? I said, why don't you go to bed early tonight? There we go. Shortcuts. Thank you. I was hoping we'd get this. All right. When it's displayed, you get up of the town. Hooray! All right. Let's hit the save. Yeah, go the fuck to sleep. Don't make me get Morgana out here. We keep him locked inside one of the back rooms. Ah! God. All right, let's get into the actual combat. Let's actually swing a sword in this game or shoot ourselves in the head first. That'd be nice. I should go to bed. I sure hope no crazy shenanigans happen. Oh, God.
God, the bed's so small. I like his little shelf up top, though. That's cute. Practical. Oh, he's like... Randy, thank you for the 49 with the Prime Man. Thank you for keeping it going. Thank you for being amazing. Fantastic. And always being here and keeping... Just being, just being awesome. Thank you for... Almost big 50, too. Welcome back. I feel exhausted. Maybe it's because I haven't gotten used to living here. I feel that. Like, the first few days of, like, my new school and I went when I was in eighth grade, I had, like, a throbbing headache for, like, a solid week straight. Overstimulation of the max. Tired. Ah, oh, that's such a mood. Cha-ching. Just who was that old man from the dream I had last night? And what was that contract all about? Hmm. I think I signed up for an MLM. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! What the? Looks like he's a little worn out. What? Without changing out of his uniform. Brand why? Brand of God! <laughs> Unstoppable. What? What? <laughs> what the fuck, Rico? What? Right, I've got. Th thank you for the eight gift subs. Topping it off with that—that that was so sub train. The timing. Oh, you were trying. Were you trying to get it with it? So close. So close to sync up with the dark. Guys, what the? It's it's so preemptive and out of nowhere. What are you doing? What are you doing? It's starting again. Oh, but we haven't even fucking swung. We haven't hit nobody. What are y'all doing? PK. With the 10 once again. St I th still sub gifted out here, and here we go. I <laughs> And a random guy with the A gift subs again. Thank you so much. What are you guys doing? Hold on. What are y'all saying? What are y'all doing in here? <laughs> Holy shit, I keep firing. This is the new age of white. It's a cold waifu war out here. Oh, the power of influence. Good lord. Y'all, thank you again. Fucking for real? Oh, for real? Oh my god. Thank y'all, PK! I appreciate! Please all, give your gifters a big thank you with PK, random guy. Uh, it truly, the P5 royal vibes never went anywhere. They're right here with us. Thank you guys so much. Both of you collective. You guys are fighting on my behalf. The fuck? Also, Dragon Warrior with the 200 saying, here are some things for you and some biddies on top. Thank y'all. Thank you, thank you. Wow. wow. Incredible. Dark hour means a whole extra hour of gifts. Oh my, oh, you're still. <laughs> Red of guy, thank you so much. Thank you. And then so Saki, thank you for gifting that sub as well. So, thank you for hanging out here. Hope you're doing great. Thank you. We're, we're tap, we're, we're popping it up. Guys, what? What is the compulsion? Oh my god. Magazine, thank you for the 1600 biddies, baby! Can't- WHY?! <laughs> uh, oh, for real? Dare I say- I've been waiting for this. Can you believe it? Can you fucking believe- This is Bean. Ah! Ah! Oh, oh yeah. It's all coming together. What the- Mag- What are you doing? You're just giving a- There's no messages for that! My man- <laughs> My man has passed the fuck out- Oh my- ah! Nothing has changed since Hold- night. Oh my god, look at him in the background. Holy shit, yeah, he has conked the fuck out. They're spreading! Uh, Magnus D, thank you so much for those bits! You're- You're the big bit with that? I greatly appreciate it! What the hell? Uh, what the? Who's the fuck? You guys are going like excellent. Honestly, there's so many subs today. It's almost like four thousand U.S. dollars. Keychain, once go fucking great. Okay, I'm done. I just wanted to have some fun. The top bit is mine. Oh god, you got fucking. Mamma mia! Huh. Been All of you been naughty. Financially, popping off. Keychain, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you for the ten. Guys, please be sure to give your gifter a big thank you. Dragon Warrior with a 400. Say, top bun is, or top big bid is you? Oh, it's a numbers game. It's got to update. 
I'm gonna need to plow through them for 70 hours becomes 150. I know, I know. Oh god, guys, thank you so much. Very interesting. Thank you guys. All right, Moontail, thank you for the 60 saying five years old. Now the subscription is ready for pre-K. They grow up so fucking fast. Not Holy shit. Not what is going on? You guys are back and Even forth and so hard. The potential. Just want to support the wedding. <laughs> the wedding. The wedding too, apparently. Seriously, keychain, PK, random guy. You guys are MVPs. Thank you guys so much. Memory loss. And for everybody else who gave as well. Nick sees it. Thank you. Thank you. This subject is rather unique. He hasn't exhibited any of the common symptoms. Yeah, it's the blue hair and the pronouns that are protecting him. Him like a guinea pig. Oh, don't look at it like that. The two of you are classmates, right? Yeah, he's not a guinea pig. Yeah, there's... Yukari, go grab the carrots that we put inside of his, uh... His, 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 uh, his mini-fridge. All right, see, so make sure he doesn't see those. To have someone your own age here. Also, we probably should, like, dislocate the giant, uh, water fountain on the side of the window. I think that's also a little telling. Besides, we need all the help we can get. Yeah, no, C's is kind of in, in disarray right now. It's We're not exactly pumping iron out here. Did somebody say guinea pig? <laughs> Get Tay in here. Akihiko, what's wrong? Oh god, they're coming up on the intercom. <laughs> Akihiko, what's wrong? Uh yeah, well, um, I just got to Burger King and uh they they are out of burgers, guys. It is just nugs. <laughs> You're not gonna believe it. This thing is huge. It's a chicken nugget, if you can believe it. Unfortunately, it's chasing after me right now. <laughs> oh my god, you can hear it. It's coming right at him. Oh my god, Akihiko, run! I'm almost back. Just letting you know in advance. <sighs> Random guy, thank you, so <laughs> thank you for gifting us up to Takemi. <laughs> oh my god, the waifu wars are fucking bad. Does that mean... He's bringing that thing here? Oh my god. Hold on, make sure it's turned off. Mr. Chairman. That's enough observation for now. We need to prepare for combat. Uh, right. Be careful. Akihiko! <laughs> that, determination. that thing kicked the fuck out of him. Determination? What in the undertale? Magus, they thank you for the hundred. Thank you for them biddies. Congrats on being the big bit. Seriously, thank you so much for that. That was Unstoppable. power too. And also, on An thank you, Anya. Not Anya gifting a sub to Atlas West, and they've been sub for two months. I think. Sorry, we gave the sub back to Atlas before. Thank you, Bumby, for gifting a sub to Atlas. Akihi, walk it off, champ. Walk it off. Channel that protein powder. Repair your bones. I'm all right. Get ready to be surprised. It'll be here any second. Like, like a last surprise or just a surprise? Like, this is no time to joke around. Well, no, that's well, it, no. Joker would be joking around, and if this was P, okay. I'm is it one of them, Sonata Kun? Sorry, it writes itself. Yeah, but not an ordinary one. It's big. <laughs> it's goopy. You've gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Chairman, please head for the command room. Takeba, go upstairs and wake him up. Then escape out the back. But what about you two? Oh, ooh. We'll stop it. Oh, new remix? Oh, this is hot. You're the one who led it to us, Akihiko. So I'm going to have you fight. It's big, hairy, and pink. Asked it to follow me. What are you waiting for, Takeba? Go! Uh, okay. Meanwhile... <laughs> A loud noise woke me up. Bitch, we fucking fell asleep with our full clothes on. She's coming in. No, no, I sleep in the nude. Oh, no. Oh, okay, just get him. All right. I'm a team player, okay? We'll leave through the back. Oh, wait. Take this just in case. I just love the idea of her just like having that just somewhere on her person strapped to the back of her leg or something, the boot. She kept that in her shoe. 
Guys, let's play the game of where the fuck was Yukari keeping that short sword? Right. We should be safe now. We did it, guys. The Minecraft grass will protect us now. What the fuck? Mitsuru, why are you glowing? Oh, I guess this is just like... Is this Persona telekinesis? Yes, I hear you. Be careful. There appears to be more than one enemy. Oh my god, Mitsuru, you're up here too? Hey! The primary one's lurking somewhere nearby. Oh my god, you look great from this angle. Oh my, you get a haircut, girly pop? Oh my god, just this two of us hanging up. Hanging out. Up here, alone. They can't reach us. Now when we're hanging out, just the two of us. Oh, okay, well, I guess I gotta help now. What are we gonna do? It's at the front door. Should we go upstairs for now? Yeah, let's go on the roof. <laughs> let's corner ourselves. Why not just evacuate? Oh, I don't know. Again, we don't know why. Dramatic tension. Oh, thank God they left it in here where we have to dramatically like climb the stairs ourselves. It's dangerous outside. You'll hurt yourself, sweetie. <sighs> let's get. God, what? That was a sigh. Let's hurry. down getting to safety is our priority they can wait okay we're gonna we're all no we're gonna go we're snooping we're snooping hang tight okay i don't care hey. stay in the room i i don't care hey. not joking <laughs> hey we're in danger uh, i wonder okay i'm not sure we'll do anything about this we need to focus and get away what the we have to go okay fine 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 what if i get a drink first Okay, damn it, all right. Well, no, 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 uh, listen, Yukari, the power's out, but you can stick your arm in there, right? You got skinny arms, let's go, uh, whatever. I'm thirsty. Sorry. The grinder hookup is here. Yeah. Don't worry, I want, I'm serious, I want to provoke this. I want to see what all I can do. It's dangerous. How is it possible? Okay, fine, we need to hurry up. DoorDash is here, someone ordered mac. Say like the Burger King's here? Oh. What was that? <gasps> it's getting closer. It's coming. Keep moving. Hurt. Right. If we go out through here, then So we should be safe for now. Uh, I really hope we don't get ambushed by a congealed theater troupe. Uh oh. Huh? Huh? Hmm. Oh, oh, real cutscene. Oh, the moon's so nice. Look at that cheese. No way. Way. Uh oh. Oh God! It's the ensemble. That's it. One of the monsters that attacked us. Damn, they look good. Damn, he got hands. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I just <laughs> the imagery of it is so funny. Getting charged by a monster. I gotta shoot myself in the head real fast. <laughs> God, it just beat it. Fuck. Wax the fuck out of her. I saw a little preview of this and it's so funny. It literally just fucking decks her. <laughs> oh, you got walk it off, honey. You're fine. You're fine. It's here. <laughs> Wait. <sighs> oh, fuck. He's like, ah. Eros is like, hey. Do it. It'll be, it'll be really cool. Go on. Shoot yourself, idiot. Do the thing. So. <sighs> Let's go. I like the first one better, but whatever. 
Hey, Orpheus. Master Strength. We're here to play a little ditty. By the power of gun. Just as we thought. Oh, man, these cutscenes look so... <laughs> He's like, wow! He's like, wow, he didn't die. Transform! Let's get a little more emo up in here. Yeah! Thanatos on the side, baby. Oh, this is honestly, this is my favorite starting persona. It's so fucking cool. This, like, this is peak design. I don't think we've really gotten past this. Oh, wow, he's ripping this thing. Wow! He's going crazy. Oh, it's squirming. Oh, ooh, wiggly. Me when I get my hand on some gummy worms? Mmm. Alright, tutorial! Ah, oh, god, that's so fucking cool. This looks so nice. <laughs> Damn, graphics! Damn, I guess he is cool as hell. What's that? Yeah, how does your starter look this badass? Alice, explain. <laughs> Even the pro tag's like, uh. No, there we go. Sounds like someone just ordered a stupid looking boss. <laughs> no. Get him. The theater tree. Oh! Ah! Ooh, I got it. Oh, shadows. Did they fall <laughs> from that other one? <laughs> Hmm. Strong baby, baby, baby. The ah, is a little funky. It's a, it's a, it's got. That's it's got a, it's got a tang to it. The best way I can describe it is kind of like when I'm editing and I do a pitch shift by like one percent. That's what it sounds like. Anyway, let's spin, y'all. Let's get some baby babies. It's mass destruction. No over. Oh, let's, let's admire it first, too. Don't eat truth, there ain't no truth. Destruction! Ooh, yeah! Hmm. It's more jazzy. I think mm, I think I like OG Mass Destruction better. I don't know. I can't tell if this is a case of like it's different, but it, but I think I like the, yeah. I think like when the uh, it's like the whole group sing it. Ooh yeah, ba da ba 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 ba. -da. It needs some yeah. It needs a, it needs some harmonizing in here. Not bad, but weird. It's like again, it's like a it's like putting lemon in your water, you know. Even though there's only like already an orange in it. <laughs> All right, cool. Ba, 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 bum, bum. I do love the little revolver UI thing. I remember when we first saw fo uh, footage of this and people were like, they got rid of the, the revolving UI. It's like a gun barrel, but they kind of kept it. They put like a, a crescent moon and then the uh, the attack thing rolls out like a gun revolver. So, uh, all right, let's do Persona. Anyway, fire. Oh, baby. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Mild, <laughs> mild destruction. That that is. There we go. I would just say mild destruction. It's not bad. It's just like it's one of those songs where it it sounds like it just has changes for changes' sake, and I don't know if that always works. Like I can clearly tell the difference between the two. So say not bad, but a little different. My mid destruction. I would say mid destruction. Oh, and he and yeah, and he's fucking out of here. Are you okay? Oh, come. 
Oh yeah, the anime cut-ins are my favorite. That was hot. Yeah, I've seen I've seen footage of those as well, but it's like, ooh, it hits different. Yeah, it's different, still good. Still good. It's still it's still it's still got destruction in there. It's so good to see you again. Oh my god, thanks, Igor. And then mean it does like a meanwhile cutaway to you, Kari, being like, wake up! Wake up! And then they got me in the hospital doing CPR and put me on IVs, hooking me up. After awakening to your power. Oh my god, my potential? Ooh. HD nose. That it was Orpheus who heeded your call. Yeah, I can see, ooh, I can see the, that nose in 4K. It's poking through the screen. That was the power of Persona. Yeah, and we snooze for about a week. We're literally, like, this is, it's like a, like a two minute conversation and it, like a whole fucking week passes by. You ever had those, like, ever had those naps where you just like, I'm just gonna rest my eyes for a bit and then you like wake up and it's dark and you have no idea where the hell you are. Persona, my psyche. Okay. A persona is a facet of your personality that surfaces. Do I have the DLC's music? I, no, I don't have any of the DLC right now. You can think of it as a mask. That protects you as you brave many hardships. Thank you. Our personas like Final Fantasy, so ah, no, he's, like, as Igor just said, they are a mask. They are a manifestation of your inner self. You know, it's like in the the the, the magic world. It's like your your you know your stand. I I don't get it. The power of a persona is the power of one's soul. And the soul is fueled by the depth of one's bonds. As you form these bonds by becoming involved with others, your own social links will gradually develop. The strength of these social links will foster the growth of your persona abilities. Please remember this. Now then, time marches on in your world. Thanks. Keep you here any longer. Yeah, that hospital bill's racking it up. Actually, I forgot it's Japan. It's actually going to be affordable. Until then, farewell. <laughs> and we're out of here. I feel like Igor's new voice. I think it's good. It captures the essence. My head is clearer. I can feel someone's presence beside me. And then... You're awake. I've been staring at you for seven days. How do you feel? I, the fact that I've been knocked out for several days or something, and the fact that she was just like ready by my side the entire time. You like me or something? Where am I? Actually, I should ask why she's here. Finally woke up. No, but play it back. Play it back. Tatsumi Memorial Hospital. It's just a short walk from the station. Yeah, I haven't blinked since. The doctor couldn't find Yeah, this is not going to help the rumors. You were just exhausted. She didn't shower this whole time. Hey, She's like, uh, fucking finally, you're awake. I can take this diaper off now. I've been sitting here the entire time. I'm sorry I wasn't helpful at all back there. Also, she's been like, you know, taking some of the IV for herself so she can maintain sustenance. Now, this is a pretty shot. Yeah, the lighting in here is much better. It's so crazy how, like, all of this is so familiar, but it's so glowed up. It really does feel like wow. new. That power of yours was really something. I mean, it is new. It's only built from the ground up. You guys know what I'm saying. Like, I'm, tr I'm jealous of people who have never played Persona 3 for the first time, and this is like completely fresh. What? 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 what, what are the, yeah, yeah, yeah. What the? What, what the fuck? What? You mean the shadows? No, the theater troupe that attacked us. And that power you used, we call it Persona. Don't worry, we'll explain everything. Hey Buns, I'm legit exhausted after work today, so I'm gonna have to pop off for bed now. Love you and thanks for streaming this amazing game. Thank you for joining us. Please get some sleep. Thank you, thank you. And of course, yeah, we're gonna be we're gonna be plowing through it this month, so hope you can join in later. Yukari never showers. She's stinky and <laughs> You heard it here first, y'all. Gagzooksies, thank you for the hunter. <laughs> the truth we we gotta make it known. It's true. Stink <laughs> So, yeah, so those are the rumors. It's like, oh, yeah, she has a boyfriend. No, the real the real rumor is that she doesn't fucking shower. All right. She's been applying the same deodorant every other day and has not showered uh, once. I wanted to tell you something. I can kind of relate to you. I mean, what? 
What do you mean? My dad died in an accident when I was little. And my mom and I aren't exactly on good terms. You're all alone too, aren't you? To be honest, <laughs> We've had IBS Yukiko, now we've got Stinkari! <laughs> oh, I, poor IBS Yukiko! I like this. I, li I like this new headcanon we got going on. Hashtag, stink hashtag Stinkari! But it didn't seem fair, so I wanted you to know about mine too. See, you can't, you can't actually smell it right now, but if you listen closely, you can actually hear it radiating off her skin. <laughs> Potent. This was a while ago, but there was a big explosion in the area. Where did IBS Yukiko come from? I, I think I had just gotten like the farts uh, sound effects on my board. We were playing through P4 Golden on Steam and we just <laughs> just rolled with it. Yukari's got really bad IBS or our fucking Yukiko's got really bad IBS. <laughs> IBS Yukiko from P4. True story. Stupid and hashtag Stinkari be telling where. We do. <laughs> their new comedy duo. You've heard of, you know, Cheech and Chong, not great for Stupe and Stinkari. <laughs> Beef for Brittany, thank you for the hundred. <laughs> Supposedly, my dad died in the blast, but nobody really knows what happened. At the time, he was working in a lab run by the Kirijo group. So I'm hoping if I stick around long enough, I'll find out more about it. Yeah, I love someone trauma dumping at me immediately after waking up from a cup. But this is probably the funniest thing. I think Yukari is so funny in the sense that, like, I actually like her a lot. You know, she's a character with a lot of, like, you know, background and family tra drama and trauma. Um, but the, she has, like, zero social awareness, which I think is so funny in the sense that, like, she just doesn't understand that, like, I literally just woke up from being incapacitated for several days and you're out here telling me your life story, like, girl. Like, <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> your father died of stink, mom! And no! I was there when this happened to you. Me. 5, bits. What the heck? Right? Right? Magnus D with the hundred, or the, with the, I'm sorry, Kraft with the dollar, reminding us that Magnus D is the big bit with the 5,400. Thank you so much for that, truly. Yeah, yeah. Very surprised out of nowhere's biddies. Kraft, thank you for the buck, though. Uh, I was saying, giving credit where credit is due. Not that I was much help. I kind of panicked. That was my first time facing them, too. I mean, the way you got completely slugged from the side was really funny. You know, when he, like, went up to you and said, hey... You did good, you know, taking the blow on that. Thanks for being a human shield. I have to go through all this if I weren't such a coward. It's not your fault you can't shoot yourself in the head fast enough. Thanks. Sorry for telling you all this the minute you opened your eyes. See, okay, I take it back. She's got a little self-awareness in that case. While I was waiting, I thought to myself, I've been hiding so many things from him. As soon as he wakes up, I'll tell him the truth. See, I had a whole several days staring at you to mull this over, so I've been, like, rehearsing it in my head. Jarek, thank you for the 78 saying, my bread is burnt and my day is wonderful for... Welcome back. Thank you, thank you. Thanks stick for sticking around. Oh, the 78, almost big 80. Thank you. Thanks for listening. I've been wanting to share By that story way, with someone I for a long time. Myself. And you chose me out of all the people, the person you've known for, what, a few days? Thanks for picking me. Okay. Um, we literally just met, yeah. The others know you're okay. They said you could leave once you regain consciousness. So I think you're free to go home. See you. Also, that'd be $20,000. If this was in the US, we'd be fucking like in medical debt immediately. Oh, welcome back. I gotta say, I'm so relieved now that you're out of the hospital. Don't push yourself, though. You want to get some rest? Don't worry. Your room's safe now. I went through it and grabbed everything. <laughs> All right, you said it'd be late today. Processing, all right. Try to overdo at school tomorrow. Yeah, okay. Yeah, let me just process this really fast. Everything's fine. I truly do love how just like non-reactive and st uh, static he is. Really, like this, Persona 3 is so like unintentionally incredibly funny. Um, and the fact that he's just so deadpan the entire time is easily one of it. And, and like, and it's definitely accentuated here because there's so much more detail now, and he's literally just default face the entire time, intentionally so. It's not a matter of like PS2 limitations. It's a choice, you know. All right. 
Hold on one second. A stink Kari is hella invested after a day run. <laughs> She's like, so what are we? She says, I noticed you were wearing a clothespin over your nose earlier. What was that? What? what, what, what? Is, there, is there a problem? No. Stinkari walked with us that one time and now her smell is on us and she believed we're hers now. It's literally like in, in SpongeBob where it's the, like the onion ketchup smoothie or Sunday. That's Yukari. I'm sorry, Stinkari. Small details I love. He wears slippers in his rooms. Wasn't a thing. I did notice that. It's really cute. There's always something I tell you. What happened? Also, uh, old Kay Lewis, thank you for the eight months, saying, hey, we just met and you're just in a coma. Let me tell you about my dead death. <laughs> Jeez. Woo! How you doing? Someone's full of energy today. I could hear you from all the way over there and I could smell you from over there, honey. How you doing? I see, I'm running with this now. Stinkari's too good. Gagzook says, you've done something. You've unlocked something in me. You two didn't come to school together. Yeah. Stupid or something. <laughs> she said the thing. The Presso Coon, are you feeling better? Um, Say my name one more time. That's how I'm feeling. Sorry to hit you with this as soon as you've recovered, but the chairman wants to talk to you today. You heard the, uh, head to the dorm after school and come to the fourth floor, don't forget. What? You're being called to the chairman? What the heck did you do? Like it's something serious. All right, yeah, yeah. I know this game. Okay, what am I doing? Are you stupid or something? At least you can press charges. You, Kari, the smelly need hyperfixing on that one guy that didn't immediately hit on her. She's like, why doesn't he like me? He's so mysterious. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah, blah, blah, blah. I'm, I'm fast forward. I'm a fast forward. Unless, oh God. This is so nice. Like, I, I, I couldn't do this in the original P3, so I'm like, ooh, baby. Uh... Stone Age, la da 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 da. B, is it B? Boneyards, midden, or the second one. Mm. That's right, thank you. Fast forward, fast forward. Oh God, this new status chart is so cute too. I hate this teacher so much. Get this man out of school. What he do? Hey. Wanna walk home together? Um. Sure, thank, thank God I've, we thank God I can't fucking happened. smell anything right now. I've been a little worried. Oh my God, hun I, for, I didn't realize how possessive she was. I feel responsible for that, you know? Well, let me make it up to you. You've been making up a lot of things lately. Maybe we should just stop hanging out so you have stop things like, you know, make it up for Come stuff. On, let's go. This is a new scene? Okay. Home safe. For now. Oh, these transitions are so cute. Oh, I like the little clock. Oh, look at that. I, I just noticed the line. I'm glad you're feeling okay now. Well, I guess I'll head up first. Like I said this morning, meet me on the fourth floor. The chairman should be waiting for us. She's already planning the wedding. <laughs> what the? Huh? If you want to go ahead. Okay, I, this this remix is really good. So I'm, I'm admiring the Lotus Juice, guys. I'm a big fan. What the hell is shining in my bed? A Twilight Fragment? Hello? I haven't seen anything like this before. I should hold on to it for now. Hmm, okay. I guess the game will explain later. All right. Let's go to the fourth floor. It's crack. Mitsu, this is what Mitsuru's undercover for. All right, she's trying to get down to the bottom of it. Someone keeps putting crack under people's pillows. There's an accessory called Sigma Drive. Oh my god. Oh. Hey, Mama. Hey. I can use this for synthesis. Okay. 
Looks like you've recovered. Oh god, I'm still not used to his voice. Yeah, Chairman Chairman is definitely like probably the most different, um, like personality wise because of the voice change. There are some things I need to discuss with you. That's why I asked you to see me so soon after your discharge from the hospital. The retro with the 64, baby! Sorry, I cannot stay because spoilers, but wow, Nintendo 64 months. And also, baby, 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 baby. Thank you for the babies. The babes back to back. Don't think I've ever got. But retro, thank you for the 64. No worries. Please stay spoiler free if you can. Thank you for popping it at the very least. Thank you for the babies back. Uh, please, have a seat. Before that. Akihiko, why are you glaring at me? But this is Sanada-kun. Are you like squaring me up? Being like, looking at me being like, how can I take you? Hey there. Okay, oh yeah, there we, all right. Okay, now, aw, oh, there's the smile. Okay, he's got. Okay. Oh, now it's mad again. <laughs> this. 420 is upon us two days. Would you believe me if I said that a day consists of more than 24 hours? Excuse me? That's a reasonable reaction. So is the whole game remade or is this just uh, enhanced graphics and added content? The whole game has been remade from the ground up, but it's incredibly accurate to the original, if that makes sense. This, the, how about this? The original P3 does not look like this. Um, but all the things that you're seeing is stuff from the original game. At least, like, the scenes are playing out the exact same. Every- the story's the exact same. It's- it's very much honoring the original experience, but visually and gameplay-wise, it is a massive improvement. It's been completely overhauled and built from the ground up. Um, so yeah, it's not like it's the original game and they slapped on, like, a pretty skin mod, too. This is built from the ground up. Um, so basically, this is Persona 3 with Persona 5 quality in every department. Um, take that as you will, if that's helpful. So it's not it's not like a simple remaster. This is like brand new out of the box. As someone who's like knows this game very well, um, like the story beats so far are completely accurate, but visually and the gameplay stuff, massive difference. This truth firsthand. Yeah, it's actually a good remake, if you can believe it. It's a faithful it's a faithful remake, but a massively improved remake. Not so much so where it's like, you know, um, uh, it changed things that make sense and a general improvement across the board. This game wasn't scared to change things in the case of like honoring the original too much because there's some things that just need to be tweaked. You remember the night you first arrived? New and improved. New and improved. The signs. Street lights going out, things that stopped working, the inexplicable appearance of coffins. With so many things amiss, didn't it feel like you'd stepped into Is the script uh, updated dialogue? There's like a few things. Um, I, I, I can't compare it exactly. I'm sure there's some translation differences and all that. Um, at the very least, when it comes to like the school questions are different. So that's changed. Yeah, there's script changes in this for sure. Um, but if I had to recommend somebody like, oh, I want to play Persona 3. What should I play? Play this. Play this. Um, there's several versions of it. Like there's P3 Portable, but that's a vi visually a very different game than this. Persona 3 FES, still a great game. I still recommend playing it. But again, for the sake of like accessibility, convenience, and also just pure style, I, I highly recommend this. So if you've never played Persona 3, play this. That's the dark hour. A and if you like this and you think this is a great game, then go pla go and play the other version so you can get a better appreciation of like how far this has come. All right, hidden between. I guess it's more like something people simply aren't cognizant of. But the dark hour does exist. Wouldn't it have been funny if they decided to stick with AI controlling your party? No direct that. See, that's the thing is like those are changes that technically are not quote unquote honoring the original, but is a change that is very necessary because of just like modern audiences and like what we're used to at this point. But yeah, that would have been ballsy as fuck if they kept that where it's like the, there's no um, uh, party control. So for those who aren't aware, the original Persona 3 and FES, which is the PS2 versions, um, they, uh, famously, you could not control your party members. They were all on an AI. You could change the AI settings of, like, what they should prioritize, like healing or attacking. Um, but you could only control the main character, and everybody else was kind of, like, you know, literally just roulette. 
And the AI was infamous for being kind of stupid in very crucial moments, where there were several occasions, anyone who's played Persona 3 OG, where you would get party wiped because one of the characters, mind you, it's a turn-based game where each turn is really crucial, and they would cast something that is completely fucking useless and, like, wouldn't heal the team when they need to. So, yeah, uh, looking back from, like, the developers talking about why they did that, because, like, after P3, they, they, they did full party control for P4 and 5, um, people complained about it so much. It's because the AI was goofy and would mess up sometimes, but apparently they, apparently it was a choice. I, I was surprised by this, um, so that it could kind of like simulate, you know, the fact that you have like no control over things in life or that kind of deal. It was one of those, like, we're doing it to like reinforce the narrative and the theming, but the gameplay really suffered because of it. So it's like, I don't, I, I, I feel like you'd find very few people who would defend the no party control at this point. <laughs> Um, yeah, P3, yeah, P3P had direct commands, but that came out several years after the original P3. At that point, they were like, yeah, fuck it. Like, we don't, we, we need to have direct party control because people are used to that now. Um, anyway, fun fact. So, um, as I know, thank you for these 16 months. Welcome on back. It will happen tonight and every night to come. Normal people don't realize it since they're all sleeping inside their coffins. But that's not what makes the- Oh yeah, and also the fatigue system has got- The fatigue system was very passive. I'm- I'm kind of whatever about it. Creatures. Um, like it was slight- Like the- the fatigue system was kind of just like put there in place to make sure you just couldn't like giga grind and eventually the characters would get tired and be like, I'm out of here. We call them shadows. Whoa. It's our job to defeat them. Pretty exciting, huh? You'd be surprised at how many people defend the lack of party control. I know people do, but it's a very small percentage of folks. Because, like, I can understand the argument of it is reinforcing the narrative, it is important to the theming, blah, blah, blah. The flip side is that um, you're going to get game overs that are completely outside of your control, and it's frustrating. So it's like, I see the, I see the coin. I see both sides of the coin. Um, but I cannot use this coin to purchase the thing that I want. Do you see the issue? Akihiko, why are you always like this? They kept one aspect. If you go to uh, to the nurse after TARDIS, you get a courage. What? That is good to know. Thank you, Nick. Thank you. you just got hurt. We need high courage because we got to be able to, to hit up uh, Mitsuru when we need to. Now, now, he does his work well in any case. I'll get to the point. We are the Specialized Extracurricular Execution Squad. C's for short. On paper, we're classified as a school club. But in reality, this group is dedicated to defeating the shadows. It's also a tax deductible. Mitsuru Kirijokun is the leader, and I'm the club advisor. <laughs> a shadow feeds on the mind of its prey. Look, look, I did a merciless female on P3P, and I did not touch the party AI until the final phase of the final boss, and even then only to guarantee the win rather than risk having to play through a third attempt. Yeah, it's just, it's one of those things where, like, you can get through the game and stuff, but it, it's, it's a frustrating aspect for folks because no one likes dying to something that they feel like they have no control over. Um, and that's, and it's like, also runs up against the problem where it's like, yeah, sure, the party's thinking for themselves and all that kind of thing. Um, but it also starts to make you like resent the party members for being dumb as fuck and like make, basically getting you killed. So yeah, ultimately, I think giving people party control is a plus um, just because it is, you know, I, Persona is a story heavy thing. The gameplay elements of it is secondary in my opinion. Um, so it's like the more, the, the more convenient, the, the, the better in my opinion. They're responsible for also, yeah, depression's going around. Apathy oh. syndrome, quote unquote. It's not just normal depression. It's advanced depression. Huh, what about the? P what about them? I don't know. Although rare. Now the police are busy making sure people pay their subway fares. The dark hour. Some may even awaken to a power that enables them to fight shadows. That's known as Persona. The power yeah, super duper ultra depression. Depression too. ...can only be defeated by Persona users. Your school let you have an execution? <laughs> Your club name, right? <laughs> this is I know we're in Japan. Um, all right, I see. I see, and I'm in C's now. I'm glad you're quick to understand. 
Hey, I know you just got out of the hospital after dying and stuff, but can you please put your life back on the line? <laughs> Listen, I, I know some of those ribs are still healing and all that, but could you, like, go take care of this for us? We're kind of kind of low on manpower. Gagzooksies, thank you for the hunter. <laughs> what he's trying to say is we want you to join us. Here's your gun. Here's your honorary gun. We've prepared an evoker for you. We'd like you to lend us your strength. <laughs> Alrighty. <Ooh. laughs> I was afraid you'd say no. I'm <laughs> glad to hear you're on board. Thank you so much. Truly. Mm -hmm. I almost forgot about your room assignment. Why don't you just stay in the room you have now? Okay, bet. I don't it's... know what the holdup is, but I guess it worked out in the end. <laughs> we also have the camera set up in there, all right? Don't worry about it. Hold up? But wasn't that. Uh huh? Oh, never mind. Look, we need people who can handle Stinkar. You're the first person to not turn into goop after a day in a while, so you're in. <laughs> We're a little desperate. <laughs> Magus, thank, thank you for the hundred. You can commit fake suicide now. What the? And then, guys, what the? Depression tournament edition photoing Dante from Devil May Cry. Oh my god! It's not just normal depression, it's. Duh. Depression. Oh no, it's it's very scum. Depression. All of my fifty. Why? <laughs> Magnus, thank you for that hundred. It's true. We can we can commit fake suicide now, Swimbuku. Gola, thank. You. Why? We're already never. Wicked, sick, unstoppable. Ah! Wow! Incredible! <laughs> what? Did someone just make a Stinkari account? Right of what? Oh my god. What? Did someone. Did you just make a separate account named Stinkari just so you could give a sub to it? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, I can, I can smell it already. Oh god, the chat is filling up. Holy shit. <laughs> Thank you for that. Gala, I don't know what you doing out there. You're cooking too hard. You're smoke too tough. They're gonna kill you. Oh my god. Don't want none unless you got buns, hon. Top bum, baby, all the way, once again. <laughs> Thank you, Cole. Cole, that better be tax return money. You better be treating yourself. Oh shit. Oh fuck. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the fool archive. Yeah, can thou shalleth also give us direction to the bathroom? Thank you. I'm lost up here. It's really bright. Where are the doors? We got the fool. There we go. Rank one, fool. Congratulations. To be honest, I've missed a bunch of this, so I had to make up for the last time. Oh, God. Thank you for your blessing. No Mama, you better pace it. You better fucking pace it. We got a full playthrough to do. Well, that's all You're for today. Top, top, top. I'll up with you regarding our club activities later on. The fuck you mean by that? I mean, I know what he means by that, so... Checking ter... All right, ter... I know terms. I know things. I apologize for gathering you all here on your precious day off. Tomorrow is Sunday, so take some time to relax. <laughs> Down the hall and to the left. Shall we end <laughs> Can Magnus, thank you so much for the 100 biddies. Congrats on being that big pet. Because it's the weekend? Shall we end? Shall we end? Get Bro! It? No, we, we... We... No. Go kill yourself! We don't got time. Boo! Boo! Yeah. Hi. How have you been? <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. Where's this camera going? And how'd you get in here? Mama, we know how he got- He fucking slipped under the door. Or just like came out- I think he just came out of the closet. I know who he is, but you know. We've met before. I know we have Pharaoh, so I'm just playing. That was a test. You failed. 
Soon, the end will come. Hmm. Obviously, like, Reload is a bajillion times prettier than the original. Like, much more vibrant, pop and love it. Can't complain. However, I, I, I will miss the angle that this these scenes normally play out on, where he's, like, at the actual base of your bed. And the camera's, like, kind of on the back end, where he's just, like, staring at you. It's just a much funnier angle, where he's just, like, hanging out. Remembered. So I thought I should tell you. I don't care. It's the end of everything. But to be honest, <laughs> this thing for the hundred saying, "Stop it! Get some help! We don't want your puns." Yeah, we want the pajama boy instead to come yell at us. It's in our sleep. This could have been an email. Yeah. It looks like you've awakened to your power, and what an unusual power it is—a power that takes many forms, yet is bound by none. It might even prove to be your salvation, depending on where you end up. Do you remember when we first met? <laughs> With that dresser sandwich between your mattress and the wall, too. <laughs> Do you remember when we first met? Yeah, you made me sign paperwork. Honor your commitment. I'm always watching you, even if you forget about me. Okay, but can you, like, drop me a copy of the TOS again? I need to read that. See you later. Oh, okay. He's out of here. Reload or Royal, which is game better? I'd have- let me get to the end of this and I'll let you know, but, uh... I have different answers for that, actually. Um... In the- like, Persona 3, aesthetically, and I think story-wise, is definitely one of my favorites. Um, but, I, like, I don't know, I have to, like, a, a kind of experience at the end. Persona 5, in my opinion, um... Because I think Persona 3, 4, and 5 are all must-plays great. I think P4 is still, like, I, I still consider my favorite. In a lot of ways, P5 is, I think, it's hard to say, honestly, because I like them for um, several different reasons. But Persona 5, at the very least, can confidently say, without a doubt, and I like I, I don't like throwing this word around a lot, but objectively, all right, Persona 5 has the best gameplay in the series. Um, but then again, now this game's out, so maybe this will be right behind it, if not a close second, considering this game took all the gameplay mechanics from P5 and put it in here, so... It's like, can I, for the love of God, get a good night's sleep around here? Okay, he's here. So what's this about? <laughs> Depression sleep, it hit different. Oh, oh, you, aw. Oh, you, Kari. Oh, we, oh, we look so, so what the fuck, Akihiko? Thanks for coming. Pimp it, pimp my ride. Drop. Woo. Oh my god. Dripped out. Honey, get a towel. The drip is all over the place. Oh no, he's hot. What? Gosh, I've never. He looks good. Hey, hurry up. It's always them white haired bitches in white clothes. Makes you look good. This is why he's my. I love Akihiko. He's so fun. I mean. Yeah! Junpei? Why are you here? Yeah, all right. Don't tell me. Oh, God. I can be your angle or your devil. Look at this. This is Junpei Yori from Class 2F. I'll be staying here from now on. Yeah! <laughs> Amazing. He's staying here? Are you sure there wasn't some mistake? No, he's got the potential. I'd He's got fuckboy potential. He has the potential, but he just awakened. Stand back! He's gonna blow a persona load. And he agreed to help out. Really? Yeah. Say, did we get all dressed up just for Junpei? I'm sorry. Did Akihiko put on? Oh my god! It's <laughs> Akihiko put on his Sunday best, and it's literally fucking Sunday. It's just like maybe it's just church getup. I don't know. I feel like Akihiko would go to church. I feel like Akihiko would be a god-fearing Christian, but like in the in the nice sense, you know. Surrounded by a bunch of coffins. I don't remember much, but man, that's embarrassing. But he said that's you know completely normal in the beginning, like being confused and not remembering anything. You guys know that? <laughs> Didn't happen to me. Sounds fucking fake. Hey, what's with the top guy act? You should know about it. Since you're a Persona user and all. 
Yeah, basically they're casual clothes, but casual is putting it lightly. It looks good. I had no idea you guys had this stuff going on too. Well, I'm glad I'm not the only one. What I really want to be doing. Had to go to church to challenge God. Be stoked too, right? Having me join. Oh, Katie Co colors. Yeah, it reminds me of him. Definitely. I guess. Well, enough of the introductions. Now that our forces have increased, I think we're about ready. Ooh, we gotta go do something? Sweetness! I'm getting pumped! With this many people, we could start checking out that tower. <laughs> oh. I like how C's is, you know, they got the evokers, they got the name, they got the chair, they got everything, but... Like, they've been around long enough to have all this shit set up, but they haven't had the opportunity to explore Tartars once. Like, they're so bad at their job. Like, this club has not made a dent. We are not going to make it to champions, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> they had to wait for the protag to show up to get anything fucking done. It's a place <laughs> yeah, the Tartar sauce. to understanding the dark hour. Yeah, sure. So we think. Stinkari's got competition. She's gonna have to really kick the stuff. <laughs> the chairman will give us more details tomorrow night, so be ready. Ex I'm pretty sure I saw him do it earlier too. It's true. <laughs> Thank you. Thank it's. He would say poggers. Literally, I can literally see Junpei typing pog in chat right now. Yeah, seriously, these guys ain't getting fucking nowhere. So I to think for the hundred as well. Listen, we just need a little more seed money uh, to reach our, our stretch goals of dealing with the threat. <laughs> all right, so we have Danny Depresso, all right, MC, Stinkari, Stupe, Ace, De Ace Defective. Okay. Oh. 25 year old Mitsuru and Akihiko undercover is 15 year old. What a cast, what a crew. What an absolute crew. No, we're professionals, all right. Okay, we got the clubs. The best part, yeah, yeah, yeah. You sing pretty gung ho. That's right. Case closed. Let's get drunk. All right, lunchtime. Ooh, I'm tired. I was about to. Oh, is this the seat? <laughs> Hey, Mama. Come to the room on the fourth floor when you get back to the dorm tonight. I have something to tell you all. Oh, are we having that talk already? The burrs and the bees. I'll save the details for later. And she's strutting out of here. Damn. Don't waste any time. She's got places to be. She's, she's busy. She's busy, you know, with the student council or whatever. Yeah, and also her progress reports, you know, where she goes around like watching people and then writing up their stuff. Whoa, Yucatan. She's too busy trying to crack the case on who's putting crack under people's pillows. It's not that I don't like her. It's just, I don't know. She's the other pretty girl here and we have to have tension. That's what the plot says. Oh man, that scene here. Sun change be crazy. They're probably waiting for us at the dorm, right? Are you heard him? Let's hurry back. <laughs> Finally made it. The crack it's me. FBI's an intern program. <laughs> Can't believe the accident delayed our train so much. It's happening a lot lately, though. It's a miserable. People jumping onto the tracks. This apathy syndrome thing's getting out of control. It's like the whole world's falling apart. Oh, honey, just you wait. It's 2009. Give it 11 years. Crap. Everyone else is there already. Uh-oh. First. Oh, man. I'm getting kind of hungry. Oh, yeah. Fuck the meeting. It's 420. We got to get munchies. It's small rocks. So many places to chow down. Junpei, whip out the pen. Speaking of, I heard the ramen joint upstairs has a secret late night menu. 
Oh yeah? Better... Damn it! No! I want to get fucking litty with my bro! It's 420! What are we doing? He's rizzing. Oh my god. He's trying to he's trying to wife me up really hard right now. Maybe next time. Uh. Yeah. Oh, I would, honey. I would, darling, in a minute. The illusion of choice. One's here. Heck yeah. Let's get right into it. Well, thank god we have like team spirit out here. I'd like your undivided. Junpei, you're not head of marketing. For a long time. Kirijo-kun and Sanada-kun were the only Persona users we had. But that number has recently jumped to five. Yeah, how fortunate. Big things happening up here with Seas. I'd like yeah. us to finally begin exploring Tartarus. 420 is the perfect day to eat a duck burger. I know. Uh, the biggest, the biggest miss. Uh, so Back at the dorm, you got any weed? <laughs> But what is that Tartar? Thing? It's like now I only have his Delta 8, sorry. It's Tartarus. You seriously haven't seen it, Junpei? Well, I mean. It's no surprise you haven't seen Has it. Has a tartar sauce Tartarus joke been made yet? A few? But we will take one more. Only during the dark hour? Also, um. Oni and Luna, thank you for the. 40 months saying, so glad you're finally going to play P3. Really fun fact, P3 for beginners video was the very first video I ever saw. It was an instant fit. Oh, oh my God. Thank you for sticking around for so long. Well, I was I was asking folks, like people who, you know, was their first exposure to me was through that video. And wow. 40 months going strong and even longer. Oni, thank you so much. Um, and uh, also uh, Blueberry Dan, thank you for the gifting the sub to Pink Sweet Rose. Thank you. The goal of our club, C's, is to fight those shadows. However, simply defeating shadows during the dark hour isn't enough. We must get to the root of the problem. We need to destroy the dark hour itself. Whoa. Uh, I don't really get it. You're saying if we run around Tartarus, we can somehow get rid of the dark hour? Listen, sees clearly for certain. not not the most forward thinking group, but it's kind of fuck around, find out mentality right now. We'll figure it as we go. But investigating the mysteries of that tower is part of our job. Stinkari is already getting aggressive, aggressive Jim Pay sitting next to the depressed. I was like scooching in on my mans. Bottom line, we need more information. Everything we encounter there will be a vital clue for us. The exploration of Tartarus is of utmost importance. Consider it our top priority. First exposure was literally just seeing some bread looking character streaming royal, and it's been history ever since, Nick. I'm happy happy to still see you around, honestly. Thank you so much. That is always surprising, I won't lie. Um, as, like, as someone who's been a YouTuber, or at least like my YouTube is five times as popular as my streaming, um, which is like kind of expected. It is always surprising, folks who organically find me through Twitch. I always appreciate y'all. That's one hell of a responsibility. But the heroes of justice will prevail. It's also the perfect so-called heroes of justice. <laughs> of our skills. That place is like a nest of shadows, you know. Whoa, they're nest, huh? But senpai, what about? Let's your not destroy the dark hour. I'm getting an extra hour of sleep a day with it. I wandered around longer. Yeah, people will be feeling so refreshed out here. Akihiko's still recovering from his wounds. He'll accompany us, but won't participate in the exploration. Yeah, the, <laughs> the exploration of Tardis is our utmost priority, which is why we haven't done anything towards that in 10 years. Incremental progress. I know. Relax. Oh, Junpei's got your back. I love how much more happy... I, I think Junpei's voice actor really knocked out of the park here. He's really good. You, Mr. Chairman? He's giving... He's giving, like... Oh, stay here. Fuckboy Golden Retriever, which is which is the essence. I can't summon a persona. Yeah, that coffin's really comfy, you know? Yeah, it's got a Tempur-Pedic in there. That's why everyone's sleeping good. I can't- I never- What Was this the case before where we where we go to Tartarus on 420? Why are we at school? I don't- Did I- Did I never notice this before? This is kind of fucking hilarious. Because oh, I, I know they changed- They moved around some dates in this game, you know, where it's like everything's not exactly syncing up calendar-wise as it was before. Um... 
I, was it always 420? I guess I never noticed. If there is a dark Maybe it's because, like, when I played this game when I was younger, I just didn't give a fuck about, like, like 420 jokes just went over my head. Uh, Shadow, thank you for the hundred. The dark hour here is real life. Then why buns and egg always up at night? What tartars in the Las Vegas? I'm gonna say, this is, this is where it's at, all right? It's the sphere. What do you think? <laughs> They've upgraded. They got a bigger budget. Shadow, thank you for the hundred. It's almost. I've gotten better with being a night owl. I've, I've decided to like. Oh shit! Here we go. It's time. <laughs> oh fuck! Oh ooh, this is cool. Ah, uh, love me a high budget Tartar's transformation. This is nice. This is, now this is brand new. Oh, this is fucking sick. Fully erect Tartarus. Wicked sick. I just got my first game over on normal. I got SMT. So, oh, we got crit back to back. This is Tartarus, the labyrinth that reveals itself during the dark hour. Labyrinth? Yes. What are you talking about? Um, it's the hit movie uh, created by Guillermo del Toro. No. Pan's Labyrinth? No. Or the, that one movie with David Bowie thought? in it? Once the dark hour passes, everything will return to normal. This is the nest you were talking about? But why? Why'd our school turn into a giant tower? What? You don't know either? No. <laughs> it's complicated. Okay, it's one of those like... It's actually not, it's not actually not complicated, but yeah, sure, okay. If we don't know, we'll just have to find out. That's a thing, it's like... Like, there are a lot of twists in this game. What Tartarus is or why it's the school is not one of them, in my opinion. Um, it's like the most like straightforward thing of like, ah, oh, okay. <laughs> Mitsuru and I have only gone in to take a peek. This will be our first time exploring it. Exciting, huh? There's gotta be something in there. Hopefully some sort of clue about the dark hour. Like, Mitsuru, you can figure out what Tartarus is if you just go looking through, like, you know, your your family's company's, like, tax returns and, like, where they're like, oh, huh, interesting. We took this property and turned it into a school for charity <laughs> or some I shit know. like that. You don't have to keep reminding me. Alrighty, I have to catch up with this on the VOD. Gotta head out uh, to bed now. Take care, y'all. Uh, Lotus Beans, thank you for hanging out. Thank you, thank you. So I hope you're Whoa. catching those VODs it's just popping in when you can. The inside. Yeah, school is literal hell for teenagers. I'm sure this isn't symbolic at all. Yeah, long, winding, repetitive, endless feeling like you're climbing a tower to nowhere. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder what it means. Malik. It's built on how many sacred burial grounds? <laughs> This is only the entrance. The labyrinth lies beyond the doorway at the top of these stairs. There's also disco lights everywhere. First, you need to get also, so jam. Place. Jam everywhere. Have a look around. What? By ourselves? We're not asking you to go very far. I'll okay, Hiko, really be like, God damn, I want to punch stuff. It's it, it. Hey, there's some universal constants, you know? The sun rises, the sun sets. Akihiko wants to punch things and eat protein. Like... The captain of a pirate ship? I'm in! Me, 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 pick me! Oh my god. <laughs> You're in charge. <laughs> Wait! Him. He doesn't look like a captain! Junpei, don't you know the cardinal rule? No one ever fucking picks a pick me. Calm down. He has experience fighting. We already. imported several burial grounds specifically for our purpose. <laughs> How did the school end up on top of the imported burial grounds? Wait a second. Um. <laughs> Tess, uh. Hold on. Sin. Next, uh. Hold on. Sin. 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 Error? Am I saying that right? I, you know me. I try my hardest out here. Actually, I don't know if you know me. You're a new sub. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the sub. Hope you enjoy those emotes. 
Thank you, thank you. Sorry if I butchered your name. Wait, seriously? That's true too, but the main reason is far more simple. Junpei, and you too, Takeda. Syntax, there we go, yeah. You summon your persona without difficulty like he can. Thank you, welcome in. Yeah, of course I can. Me too. These are shadows we're talking Been a fan for a while, well welcome in, welcome so in. You say you got the, the badge looks good next to your name. Hope you enjoy your stay. All right, let's head inside. Are you ready, leader? Yeah, how do you use this thing? <laughs> That's the spirit. Okay, so like I didn't I couldn't really read the instruction manual, but um I you know, I thought I'd get ahead of the curve. I got real bullets for the gun thing, the boop that you guys gave me. Um, I'm assuming that's what you guys load it with. So let, yeah, let's go. Let's give them a whirl. Let's show those shadows what's good. <laughs> He's like, yeah, I lost the evoker, so I brought my own. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is such a good transition now. I've been waiting for you. Truly, like, the Velvet Room in P3 really be like this, because, like, Velvet Room's blue as fuck, this game's blue as fuck. The time has come. No color contrast, Use just blue. Power. Yeah, last the Evoker, but I brought my Glock the tower that you are about for my to uncle in the States. Into. How did it come to be? For what purpose does it exist? Man, I really wish we could get Fem MC. I know it'd be a lot of extra work, but damn, yeah. Like as someone who, like, I also really want her, and I mean, here they could charge a lot of money for it. Like, if it is a DLC, it is a lot of work. Like, it's not a matter of like, oh, just replace the model. No, 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 no. You can't. Like, the, replacing the model is like step one, and then there's a bajillion other steps behind that because then you'd have to go about revoicing over every time they use a pronoun uh, for the MC. Uh, and then also all of the animated cutscenes for the most part are gonna have to be either like redone or like highly edited or spliced out and switched out character. There's just so many factors that go into it. Um, basically every asset, like the menus would have to be redone entirely. Any Anything with the male MC has to be completely changed um, and done from scratch basically and built it up. It's not a matter of just like we're just replacing the model, right? Um, and also pink, pink everything. You'd have to pinkify it. It'd be a lot of work. Um, but it's one of those things where people would pay money for it. However, they could charge 30 fucking dollars for it and people would pay for it. Um, so it's like, I, I know they've already preemptively come out and saying like, yeah, we're not going to do like a re-release. Like we're not going to give reload like a golden treatment. That's redundant. This is like the redo treatment, but they have said they're going to, they're going to do, uh, you know, the answer as DLC or some, basically something uh, similar to that in some capacity. And they specifically said, like, we have no plans for the Fem MC or anything like that. But it's like, it would be the most work, but it would be the... That would sell so fucking well. You could sell this game twice to everybody. Um, so... <clears throat> I've seen people dismiss this game because it doesn't have the Fem MC. I was in the early on. I never was, like, dismissive of it. I was just disappointed in the sense that... You know, Reload, this game existing is great and fantastic for people who want to experience the original Persona 3 FES at the very least. Um, but this game had an opportunity to have its cake and eat it too in the sense that finally we could have a, a definitive maxed out content co like collectively in one game. And this game contributed to the problem of Persona 3 having content spread across several games. You know what I'm saying? It's like there's several versions of Persona 3 and each of them have a benefit to an extent. Um, although I could say this is a pretty good, like, replacement for FES for the most part. Um, so that's why it's like, I was disappointed, and I still am to an extent, that it's like, it's a it's a wide open opportunity to um, make a mass, a, a, a final definitive version of Persona 3 encompassing all of the content for the last, you know, for the, the entirety of the, 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 the entry. Um, and then also give people a female pro uh, playable protagonist, you know, in a glammed up new game because... Um, after P5, you know, the P Persona fandom has kind of blown up and a lot of people have been asking for, at least in the case of Persona 6, to have a female main protagonist. Um, and technically we've had that already with P3P. Uh, again, but the problem with P P3P is that it is a PSP game with PSP, you know, style and it had a massive uh, uh, graphical and presentation downgrade to accommodate for it and stuff. Um, 
So that's why it's like, it's disappointing in the sense that this is an excellent remake, but it is not an all-encompassing, definitive version of Persona 3, and that's like... So I'm not gonna dismiss it and be like, unplayable, don't touch it, it's not worth it. It's just, it's just a very big missed opportunity. And now that's like, Sega's even admitted that they're interested in doing DLC for the longevity of the game, is boggling to me that they are not considering doing a female MC DLC because, like, it would be extra work, yes, but it also would be guaranteed sales because it's a high-demand thing, and clearly the fandom wants it, and there's a precedent for it of already existing, and it would also be, um, you know, appeasing folks who ask what for a, you know, a new, like, glammed-up female protagonist, you know what I'm saying? It would hit multiple bir multiple birds with just one stone. Um, so, you know, it's like, I think folks who are not touching this in, like, solidarity for the female MC, I feel like are really missing out, but it's like, it's one of those things where when the news kept coming out about, like, yeah, they're avoiding her like the plague, it's, it's just, it's basically P3FES, it was like, oh god, why? Why? It's like, why, why are you guys dodging her so hard, you know? I stay delusional, if not immediately, maybe in the next year or two. <laughs> I'm still holding out hope. Like, what we know about like, you know, this DLC whispers, it's from, like, an inside person who's, like, known for, like, being, like, a leaker or, like, some information person who's, like, right most of the time. So we haven't gotten, like, hard, concrete stuff yet, and who knows what will they'll, they'll turn out in a year. I also think a million sales within the first week is also probably a good indicator that maybe they should make a female DLC just because, you know, that's more, so that's more fucking shit sold, right? Anyway, anyway, yeah, the patriarchy strikes again. <laughs> Equality gone. All right. Your power is unique. It is like the number zero. Empty. But at the same time, holding infinite possibilities. You, my boy, are able to possess multiple personas and summon them at will. And when you have defeated your enemies, you will see the faces of possibility before you. There may be times when they are difficult to grasp, but do not fear. Seize what you have earned. I'm catching Your up. Your power will grow accordingly. Be sure to keep that- I'll just take the model replacement mod when it comes out for now. <laughs> yeah. Once again, may you open the door and come here of your own- Yeah, you can have so many little guys in your noggin, let me tell you. You're gonna be bursting at the seams with power. Don't think about it too much. Until we meet again. Farewell. Get out. And we're out of here. I mean, they adapted the game into two entirely different uh, stage plays with a male and a female MC just because she's uh, that popular in Japan. Yeah, it's one of those things where it's like, Atlas is so adamant at this point now to listening to fan demand. Cause like clearly they're listening. We've been, you know, yelling about stuff for a while and they're like, they're slowly getting to it. You know, making games accessible, uh, worldwide releases, ports, you know, remakes, things that we want to see. And it's like, that was like, they know. I'm just, I just, God, I want to know what the choice, like I want to be in the a fly on the wall. Likeable characters as social links. She's also able to bond with the entire party unlike- That's what I'm saying. Uh, Falls, thank you for the, thank you for the 10. Thank you for that sandwich. Very, very, um, uh, uh, very, whoop, there I say. Very kind of you. Uh, for the female MC is that not only was the P3P an introduction to a lot of, uh, quality of life, she had arguably the better written and likable character, uh, characters as social links. True, yeah, and she could bond with everybody. And also, like, some of her dialogue choices are fucking hilarious. Um, overall, she's, like, a massive fan favorite. It, it, it's just, it's one of those things where I, it just seems so obvious. And I know time and money is always a factor, but it seems so obvious a, a, a way to get money. You know what I'm saying? And especially as DLC, that seems like the most duh, go figure thing because like, you know, Atlas does love, they fuck, God knows they love their DLC. And I'm glad at the very least, like this is a pretty full game, you know, and they're not like walling off too terribly much or anything, but it's like, come on, you know, it's work, but it would be work well, well worth it. Yeah, what's up? Like a million copies sold within a week. Wouldn't you like to cash in on that again for maybe thirty dollars? Like, come on. Regardless like, okay, I guess let's 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 just gauge the room here, fellas. Hypothetically, um, if 
This, if uh, Reload was in the next year or so to get, or year or two even, would get a female MC, you know, Persona 3 portable pro tag in Reload for $30, all content included, zhuzhed up as it was, with, you know, with changes and everything where you could hang out with everybody. Um, would you buy it for $30? Would you buy, which is half the price of a game, a full game. I want the O back. <laughs> it's Simbi. Atlas, please. Look. This isn't marketing data, but it's real people. <laughs> please. <laughs> and maybe they're gauging it. Maybe yeah, maybe it is a, maybe honestly. It might be a case where they haven't like confirmed or denied, at least like, you know, come out blatantly. We have whispers of things right now, but nothing's in stone yet. It may be a case where they are just like, we are going to take the sum of the sales money and then we'll do it as DLC because that is how you min max the money. Like they didn't want to waste all the time and money to put it in preemptively if they could like, again, charge another $30 for it eventually in a year where they can use the funds from the initial sales to create it. Um, I, I hope that's the common sense thing we're going for. I'm, I don't like the fact that I'm out here begging for DLC. I don't, again, I, I find DLC in general just like as a bittersweet thing in the gaming industry. It's like, here's more video game, but also here's the rest of your video game, that kind of thing. Um, like the monetary stuff behind DLC is stinky, but, um, you know, it is a cool way to like get extra shit after the fact. Um, and having her be DLC seems like the most practical way to have this happen and for Atlas to get their bag, you know what I'm saying? What if they keep the Ken thing? That can go. They can cut that. I don't know what the fuck. I don't know what kind of shit they were on when they put that in back in the day, but like, no. No, thank you. No, thank you. <laughs> the, the, the rule with Persona, there needs to be one taboo relationship or else it's not, it's not, it's not a Persona game unless there's that like, ugh. Unless it's borderline illegal or if it is illegal. Let's see. Uh, I opened this door and they're like, what door? Huh? What door? Uh-oh. Man, are you loco? No, I- Oh god, St Stinkari's uh, fucking smell fumes are out here blocking everyone's vision. Have you been nodding off? You seem kinda out of it. Dude, you're supposed to be our leader. Get your head in the game. We'll be following you. Come on, let's go. Leader. It's also confusing that Atlas seemingly doesn't want to use Fink Freeload because she was used and rather prominent in Q2. That's what I'm saying. It's not like they've completely avoided her either. Um, you know, she's like popped up on other things. I don't know. Again, it's a real, I really would love to be a fly on the wall. I mean, like, why, 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 you know? Like, it just seems like one of those duh common sense thing. And lately, Atlas has been doing common sense moves for the most part. Like, come on. All right, saving in Tartarus. While well, exploring Tartarus, you can save. All right, you can you can change your party. You cannot save the four you're currently exploring. You can save. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's posed. Whoa. All right. Ooh, man. Ooh, the depth in this room is much bigger. Much cooler. Much. Ooh. All right. Oh, let me catch up. Um, B for Brandy, they with the hundred saying, while I love the uh, the female MC too, the problem is that P3P scored very low with Atlas, asked for fans directly what they wanted remade. Base P3 and P2 were the highest ranked in that poll. Yeah, maybe it's a case where they're just going off of that data. I don't know. It's just like, it's one of those things where I'm just like, I feel like they should have done. Maybe they will. Maybe hold, hold, my, hold my breath. Um, thank you for the biddies though. And... Uh, about thank you for the 57 with the baby, 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 baby babies. Uh, also, do you think for the hundred or the dollar saying, not a question uh, of if, but when. But let's be real, they would uh, repackage reload with the whole ga uh, game with a female MC and P3 reload full moon, total eclipse edition of the heart shit. <laughs> Maybe they will. In th this case, it's like, uh, you know, I'm not a big fan of the practice, but at the very least, like, one positive I can say about Atlas is that they have a stinky DLC problem, but at the very least, most of the time, it is just left to cosmetics, you know, like broken personas early game, um, and completely excluding all of the DLC, you still have a very 
fully packaged, fleshed out video game that you don't need to double dip on. You know what I'm saying? Like you can buy this game flat fee and everything and feel content by the time the credits roll and you don't feel like the, the DLC is dangling something that's like a must have over your head. You know what I'm saying? Like, or it's like walling off like the secret ending of the game or something. Well, I guess I don't know, unless the answer is fucking DLC in that case they are, but <laughs> I don't know. Regardless, for the time being, the fact that like most of the DLCs are just cosmetics is like that's that's the saving grace here. But you know, they gotta min-max their their profits somehow. It's like a uh, you know initial big releases, seventy dollars sales ain't enough. They gotta have that longevity, you know that that constant monetization. Yeah. Lest we get the fucking Persona Three re Reload Battle Pass out here. Hmm. Uh. I think, like, Persona 1 and 2 getting full remakes, I think, is a question mark. I think at this point, Persona 1 and 2 are guaranteed, above all else, to get remasters. I think that's probably what they're going to do, which they, Atlas has been doing gradually. They have to kind of go, like, you know, uh, down the line. They can't do everything at once. Ooh, ooh. The trans, ooh. Man, you can finally see all the detail on this thing. That's a lot of wire. That is a lot of just, like, coils, metal hanging out. All right, let's do it. Let's go actually go fight. Don't push yourself too hard. Now I actually get to appreciate all the gameplay changes in the gameplay. Let's go. All right. Do my... Ah, oh, gosh, it's so nice. All right, equipment. Let's check our stuff really fast. Plaid shirt. I think we're all bare basic essentials right now, so let's go with what we got. Yeah, I gotta... Let's see. Let's see it. All right. Enough yapping. Let's go. Let's actually play the video game. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh, and the walls will ooze jam! So, it's the real deal from here on, huh? Yep! Oh, the background. Ooh, look at that. So, out of- hear me? <laughs> Whoa! Is that you, Senpai? I'll be providing audio backup from here on out. Keep that in mind. And I'll be out here admiring Mitsuru's back. <laughs> Keep that in mind. All right. Wait, are you saying you can see this place from all the way out there? So out of all the things in P3, Tartarus was easily the thing that they could um, expand upon or improve upon the most, because uh, it literally is just kind of like repetitive, you know, level climbing, grinding. And from my understanding, because the gameplay is so much more fluid now, uh, grinding in Tartarus is an absolute joy. It wasn't like bad before, it just got really tedious or, or like repetitive. Um, because, you know, there's not a lot of like eye candy or things to interact with. be too tough, but proceed with caution. You'll get the hang of it as you go. Right. Got it. Why is she always like that? I told myself I wouldn't get this game because to me, honestly, this isn't a definitive version of Persona 3, but I bought it either way. Is it get the, the hooks got India? I feel that. Defeat all the shadows on that floor. All right. <sighs> And while you're at it, please keep on the lookout. Um, I, I think I lost a contact. Thank you. I'll support you as much as I can, but it's up to you to learn something. Holy else. shit, Ari, here we go. Ooh, this is nice. Yeah, look at this. Also, the ceiling's way taller. It's a, I don't know, like, before it was really, like, really claustrophobic, but ooh, ooh. Okay. <laughs> the fucking school. Formation, come on. Let's get in formation. I actually like Tartus here, though. Yeah, that's what I've heard, is that everyone's like, they just don't want to leave at this point. Okay, yeah, this is nice. Cool, big, big, big. Here we go. Uh-oh. There's a shadow up ahead. I love, I love getting in a good grind. Um, P5 Royal, I thought was excellent. Gameplay-wise, for the sake of, like, the level progression and... Uh, I do love an RPG that I can snap over my legs if I know what I'm doing. I think that's really good. It's a power trip. Um, and I'm happy to see uh, that a lot of the quality of life stuff is here as well. And um, I hope it's a similar effect of when I just get to that grind, I feel like I'm really growing. Let's start by going over how to attack shadows. Um, okay. With an enemy, you have two primary options for fending them off. The first option is to use your equipped weapon. The second option is to shoot yourself in the fucking head. The second option is to use your persona. But remember, every persona has its own strengths and weaknesses. Knowing how personas work will be crucial. Try summoning yours right now. 
destroyed a nation. Rock slow motion. Give me more information. All right, you can choose an attack or skill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, here we go. I know video games. Okay, cool. Do they have the thing where they... Okay. Ah, sorry. I'm still admiring these menus. They're really good. Destruction. Baby, baby. I'm gonna attack. His animations are slick, too. Looks like I'm a... Check this out. <laughs> I was like, are you gonna do it? Uh, Jumpy? There we go. Yahoo! Oh, it's hot. Oh, didn't they? I think, didn't, didn't they get rid of shuffle time? Or if they did, it's like different. It's like P4. It's like P4 golden shuffle time. Oh, yeah. How'd you like my persona ability? I know they changed it. Yeah, yeah, that was amazing. <laughs> you cart. I'm stink car, he throw him a bone, all right? What did you do? You fucked it up like three times already. Well done. You hater. Considering it was your first battle, you did well. But diff, okay, it's different. All right, I'm just glad it's still here. I like shuffle time. I like, I like playing the little thing of, you know, catch the card. It's different from P4 actually. Okay, let's see how it is. All right. Talk about two. You'll be fine. Don't be afraid to show what you can do. Got it. Good. The fuck? Like there's <laughs> there's bird feathers ever. Where the fuck? I'm sorry, is Sephiroth in the roof? What is this? What is all the like the d d the debris hanging in the air? It's like shadow feathers. Like don't breathe this shit, or it's just black mold. This school is like, ooh, good god. I think the school got the landlord special, and this is all like the asbestos coming out of the ceiling. The battle's about to begin. Everyone, stay focused. Bet. <laughs> yeah, this this mass destruct uh, is yeah, that yeah. For defeating enemies. It's okay. Most enemies have an elemental affinity that they have low resistance. Knock knock. Yeah, knocking. Let me handle this one. Stand back, guys. Yukari's gonna shit all over the place. Point it to my head. <laughs> the She's so funny. I can do this. Yeah! I just realized how befitting of her to actually, like, have wind. You know what I'm saying? That's it, Takaba. You give it a try as well. Bad. Weakness, one more. You tell me I can string these things together? Ooh, okay, hold up. I'm so, oh god, it's so weird not having to, like, use the, 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 the go down for the menus and stuff. I just hit the button for it. Alright, Persona 5 brain. Persona 5 brain. God, that thing is so cool. Well done. You struck yeah. the enemy's weakness. There is no dark hour. The school just has everyone carbon monoxide poison. <laughs> There's a leak. Baby, baby. Got it. Oh, these screens are so good. Yeah, that's good. That's a hot critical. Leveled up. I did it. Fantastic. Yeah, the new mass destruction is mad, but on the upside, it gives more motivation to ambush the enemy, so you get to hear the other song. That's what I've heard. Is that like um, totally. Anya's been humming it to her. So Anya's pretty far in the game at this point, so she's been playing it all week. Trying not being a creep. Great. Looks like everyone's gotten used to handling their personas. Leader. Take note of each other song good yeah I've heard little bits of it I can still sense some enemies around let's move on her senses are tang her milf senses are tangling bum 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 all right cool I'm keeping it going keep yeah. these good vibes rolling wonder how before we can get me oh my gosh the heck a box dinghy. Yes, boxes like those seem to be scattered all throughout. Congress. Now, let's see how you dance. <gasps> oh my, we are fucking under attack. Stand back. Stand back. They're throwing ass. Oh God. And they're aesthetically pleasing against my fucking Persona 3. 
Bottom's incoming! Oh, they're in the air! KT! Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in, gamers. Welcome in. As, as you can see, we're playing Reload. Today's first time for me. Um, I've been avoiding it all week, and uh, and now we're just kind of admiring it, talking about it, chit-chatting. Y'all, if you don't follow the for Forever KT, you totally should. My lovely friend. Uh, streams more than I do. And uh, you can get some amazing emotes, like a blue panda throwing it back. Look at that. The KT rate Shup gamers. Hey, bitch. Hey, bitch. I hope you guys are looking forward to the next four beginners. KT's featured in it quite a lot, actually. Sometimes they contain useful items for battle. Seek them anyway, Mitsuru is telling us about how we can steal things. Oh, sweet. So they're basically like treasure chests. Hell yeah. Let's bust it open and see what's inside. All right, treasure chest, money. Yep, 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 yep. Didn't someone pointed it out? Yeah, isn't that her co like her, uh, hold on. Isn't that like the company's name, Mitsuru's family's thing, or no? Am I going crazy? Harijo, yeah. They, it's like literally on the side of the box. It's like, hmm, maybe we should Google search this. <laughs> Use your eyes, Han. Why would that shit be there? That's her last name. Yeah, there we go. I'm fucking stupid. I'm like, wait, you know me spelling. But foreshadowing. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> Using items, life stone, skills. All right, cool. Yeah, Kurijo juke. Yeah, but, 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 but like, um, Kowalski in hands. I think I think we should look into that. Also, I just realized the oh, alerts this are only. Visuals are. It's stylish like five, but clean cut from three. Mm-hmm. So good. It is so good. Yeah, I'm glad. It's like it's a glow up, but it's still keeping P3's uh, vibes in check. Have some legend. Thank for the three bucks. Welcome on back. She spent all of her waking, uh, ta her time wa <laughs> walking the entirety of Tartars to put the boxes here. That's why she's so busy. <laughs> there, she's planting them. Our revival. There we go. All right, it's just, just like the walk around, maybe you can give yourself free shit section. Man, I'm getting hot in here. Look at my fan. Shadow detected. Looks like they haven't noticed you yet. Now's your chance. All right, they're really, they're Speaking like, tutorial, up. tutorial. This is the weirdest 420 ever, okay? These edibles hit a long time ago, and I have no idea where the hell we are. All right, types of attacks. You can swing your sword by pressing while exploring. Doing so will start combat. Striking an enemy from behind will trigger a chance. Okay, is this the new song? You'll have an advantage. Placing it at a disadvantage. All right, go into the habit of infiltrating chance encounters to gain the upper hand. Say no more. Hold on. We need to look at the dash. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh the blur. Okay. So I'm just not looking at the bottom. Navi, oh, we have the auto recovery button. It's all here. All of the quality of life stuff is here. Anyway, let's sneak up behind you. Excuse me. Oh! Next, I'm going to explain a tactic for No, Mitsuru, hush, hush. I'm listening to the new song. No, 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 I, I, I don't care. I'm listening to the song. <gasps> oh, it starts off with Lotus Juice. Oh, ooh, he, ooh, he's whisper talking. He's whisper rapping. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, so Mysterious, hey, how you doing? Welcome in. You caught it, you did it. Ooh. Okay, this is the part I've heard. Ah, oh, yeah. Okay, this is good. This is good shit. See, all right, this is good. Mass destruction's all right. The problem, though, honestly, sadly, nothing is ever going to be better than wiping all out. That, that's it. That's it. Tis the facts, though. Great, great song and all. Love the Lotus Juice. Uh, problem is, it is not wiping all out. Yeah, <laughs> <Hurry> listen. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, this is good. You know, this kind of reminds me of is uh. What is it? Break free? It's it's one. Of, I think it's from Alt uh, uh, Ultimax. Hold on. 
Uh, or is it Breakout? Yeah, it's Break. Yeah, it kind of reminds me a little bit of Breakout. All right, sorry, I clicked out of the game. Paused it, my bad. Bomb, bomb. Yeah, this is hot. This is good. It's good. All right, now knock down the other. An all-out attack. Oh, we haven't seen the all-out attack yet. Okay, I I got you. That sounds so badass. Let's give it a try right now. All that attack. What to do? Come. The enemy's down. Let's go. Oh, this is cool. Oh, it's hot. Yay! Hey, and there's the shuffle time. Let's see it. Bum 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 bum. All right. With your soul appear, you can choose one of these cards. Each type of card is a different effect. Persona, acquire a new persona. All right, cup, yeah, okay, yeah, this is... The one more as you get in the battle, the higher chance shuffle time. Oh, really? Okay, that's that's an incentive to do. Weaknesses, if there wasn't one already. If you end the battle with an all-out attack, shuffle time will always occur. All right, all right. That it? I just get a selection? That was sexy. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They already made... The grind is already ten times better. I'm about it. God, this is sexy. Wow, wow, wow. How'd you like our all -out Done and dusted. I got the title card and everything. When I saw my opening, it's like my body just knew what to do. What? Shoot yourself? <laughs> that was magnificent teamwork. It's hard to believe it's your first time. As you grasp the flow of battle, you'll learn to coordinate with each other seamlessly. Well, the quality of life updates fuck, it's so nice. I mean, from what I've heard is that the quality of life stuff is it's very similar to P5R, which was really good. It's very convenient in the sense that the, the difficulty of the game is not do, too terribly hard. Uh, which again, I don't think it's particularly a problem. I think that's kind of good. Um, but uh, it's a, it, truly a testament to like how small little tweaks can make such a big difference for people. Um, in fact, like I have a little baby essay that I've like written. Ooh, okay. Cool, all right. Nice. So who's keeping these floors all polished and wax? Look at that reflection. Um, I know this is probably old news, but Buns, did you see the LeBlanc while you were in Japan? I, I need the confirm. I did from like a higher up floor. Um, and like, I just took a picture of it. I didn't go like back down to actually see if it was legit, but from I heard people from folks, it was just like, like not like a real, like didn't even have like curry or coffee or anything like that. It was just like, it just looks like it. Um, so, you know, I, I didn't go into the actual building, but I took a picture of it <laughs> in, in Japan. <laughs> um, if that answers your question. Yeah, like we were like on the second floor, and I could like see down from like the little gotcha place we were at. But yeah, I didn't, I, I didn't go in. I just took a picture of it. I'm a fake fan. Learned. Try not to alert the enemy as you move. Very belated, but congrats on the winning. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. Wait, what'd she say? I missed that. Excuse me. Excuse me. I don't like fucked up. Just kidding. Seize advantage. The basics of combat now, but the most important thing is making decisions based on the situation at hand. I'll continue providing support, but this time, go ahead and try- Mitsuru, obviously, girl wants to make sure the place looks nice for her team to walk through. Yeah, she's she's working the night shift late at night out here, waxing the floors. Fun fact, the, the red stuff on the floor, it's not jam or blood, it's hair dye. You, my boy, are able to possess multiple personas. Oh my god, me? Wait, we might need to compare uh, pics. I was talking the alley. Hmm. I get it. It's on my feed if you're curious. It's like, you know, from a while ago. But I did post it. All right. Yeah, changing persona. Bokeh. Oh, there we go. Hey, hey. Let's hit it with the bufu. Your persona just now. It looks like you really do have a special power. Yes, uh, Mitsuru, I am suffering from main character syndrome. It's chronic. 
him about. Yeah, boofo these nuts. I love the singing lotus shoes. That's so cute. Yeah, this is a good song. Holy shit. There we Yeah, okay. Won't lie, I do kind of miss it when it was like revolving and you had to like pick it, but you know what? Convenience. It's nice to just have the actual choice to pick instead of, cause like for me with the original shuffle time, I never had to worry about missing the thing that I wanted because I was just really good at it. So I like, for me, it's just whatever. But you know, I would say it's like not a necessary step <laughs> to have it like actually twirling around and you having like time it. It's, sometimes it's just nice to get your little treat after, you know what I'm saying? I'm taking the XP. We're the shuffling, though. It, it, shuffling in spirit. The enemy has been defeated. Excellent work. Um, was that...? Well, it looks like he has the ability to summon different personas. I suspected as much after the events from the other day, but now we know for sure. Relationship with mass destruction ended. Now it's going down. That was my best friend. <laughs> All right, there's a device nearby that'll teleport you back down. All right, explore the floor. One way teleporters. Yeah, ba ba da booey. Ba 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 ba. All right, cool. Let's go. Oh, this is so much nicer. And we can run. We can strut. Hey, Wait, down some stairs. Exactly what Takiba said. Please prior. I'm pretty sure I saw this already. There is not an option to split up the team, right? We can't do the split up thing where they like run around the floor and get things. I'm kind of disappointed that they don't have it because that was like a this unique feature of this game. Initially, um... Okay, fine, fine, fine. Yeah, we gotta find the teleporter. You can? Oh, later on? Oh, I see, I was like, mind you, I'm going off of what I've read or like been seeing online. I saw that you couldn't do it, but I guess, okay, later. Yay! All right, never mind. Take the complaint and put it in the trash. Treasure chest For real? different from the one before. You think people just go online and post misinformation? Yes, that particular box is sealed and works a little different. Okay. The box can be unlocked by its own mechanism, but it needs something else to work during the dark hour. Hmm. Oh. Okay. What's that you got there? I have to put the crack on the crack machine. Special lock treasure chest can be unlocked with twilight fragments. The amount you need will vary from chest to chest, so you... Oh, is this stars? I just realized... Is this like the star system in, in P5 Royal? It's giving... It's giving star system. That's a cool box. Oh my god. All right. Oh, we've got souls. All right, cool. Oh, it's like the lockpick system. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Good point. I would say, yeah, probably more like the lockpick system. <laughs> looks like you found a teleporter. Now use it to return to the entrance. Mitsuru, that thing looks like it's gonna toaster me alive. That, that, this is how the bread gets burnt, okay? And it's me. Look at that thing. What? This, the machine is 100% safe. Just do not get in it when you have wet hair, okay? This is not safe, okay. Yeah, and we just put myself in the fryer. Sure. Yeah, how do you turn on the air fryer again? Head back. Oh my god, it's 420. Yeah, get some doinks on there. That'll fry it up. Yeah, more like lockpicks, yeah. Welcome back. So... How was it? So, Depresso. <laughs> no problem. I see. Well, if you gained confidence, that's the best thing you could have achieved. Wow! I never knew I had that kind of power! But damn! Why do I feel so exhausted? Because you were bouncing around like a little kid. Um, no, Stinkari. He has clinical depression. You say that, but fatigue is a chronic symptom. I will have you know, okay? This is different. Da 
back to <laughs> back to the ass with the five. The boys only. God, if only the the amount of money I would pay an ungodly amount for some for some boys with love. Dog, just thank you for the five. How you doing? Thank you so much as always for popping in. Are you hanging out today? Are you here to stay? Is the doctor in? Either way, thank you so much, babe, for the five. That's the effect of the dark hour. You'll become fatigued more easily. It doesn't matter. They ditched this system. To it. I have to say, though, I'm surprised. You all did much better. I, I'm, I, I'm not, uh, yeah, I'm not shredding any tears for the fatigue system. It, it really was just kind of like another thing to juggle. <laughs> Done with games for the day. Well, welcome back. Always great to have. I just want to marry Akihiko. Is that really too much to ask? Seriously? He's so husband worthy. Oh shit! Yay! We did it! Yeah! Oh, oh, oh! Sorry, my thing. Sorry, my, my soundboard fucked up. I was gonna be like, there we go. All right, and that's, gosh, look at that. Get a load of that clock. They don't make them like this no more. Here, I want you, yeah, a ask all your Gen Alpha relatives or kids or whatever and be like, hey, can you read this? Huh? Yeah, that's how we used to read clocks back in the day. They all used to look like this. Okay, I love he's practicing fucking face. Oh my god. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright. You'll be selecting to okay, the Jordan Chart Rest, I'll explain the details some other time. Uh, you did well today! Play BN! Oh my god, we uh now let's head back to the dorm. Alright, let's nap. Yeah, nice clock. Not bad. They can't! Half my students can't read cursive! Oh my god. Well, to be, to be fair, that's like, <laughs> cursive's just hard to read sometimes. At least it depends on people's penmanship. At least in the case of like a doctor using it. Like, oh my god, like getting a prescription. If the structure of Tartars has changed by the next expedition, treasure chests will have already be found and discovered. Salut. Salut, let us finish up. Uh, oui, let us call us quits. Yeah, it depends on the cursive. Yeah, well, I know, I... I know for some, like, kids or, like, Gen Alpha kids, or just in general, like, the kids are not all right, like, schools are underfunded and all that, we know they can't fucking read. Yo. Um, oh, no! Oh, God, the kids are not all right! Speaking of which, oh, good Lord. Talk about, it's like, what's worse, being delusional or you can't read cursive? Um, but at least, like, for Gen Alpha, uh, folks, it's like they because they're not being taught cursive, they don't know how to sign for things. Like, they don't know how to do a signature, that kind of thing. Again, it's like small, like, huh. This is, <laughs> this is what happens when we don't properly fund our education. Yeah, get a job! That's <laughs> This bitch. Leave him alone! <laughs> Yeah, I can read cursive, but some of the letters be looking a little funky sometimes. I mean, cursive is definitely pretty, but yeah, I'm not like you know, we're not. It's we're not constantly reading handwritten things out here now, are we? Not so much anymore. Uh, morning. Yeah. This is such a funny social link. All right, I, is that true? Well, I guess it doesn't matter. I'm looking for someone with a little more experience anyway, and Layla stank. Ignore this simp! <laughs> that concludes the main portion of today's assembly. Next, we'll hear a word from the student. Truly, there, there's... Uh, I don't... I'd have to look at the entire list, but there's, there's, a, there's one or two, or just one very dedicated person on, like, the main creative persona staff that really, really wants to fuck their teacher. Or just, like, any older woman in any capacity. The fact that this has happened so many times in every single game is like, what's going on? You know? Please welcome the new president, Mitsuru Kirijo, from class- Like, Cougar Chaser, yeah. Some, someone on the, the core persona team wants a cougar, is down bad for cougars. Thank you. And, uh, which, again, nothing wrong with that on a personal level. It's just like, you know, when the high schoolers are- <laughs> Well, 
I guess she is the most popular girl in school. <laughs> Honey, stop! Stop! Uh, uh, jealousy is ugly. You can say that again. She's got this intimidating vibe. Wait, there was an older woman in P4. I, I'm pretty sure... I can't remember her name exactly. Yeah, I, I don't know if... I can't remember if you were from Romancer either. But um, in uh, P4, the... um. When you're like a daycare teacher, there's like a MILF there that like is like, oh my god, you're so good with kids. I think she's like kind of the or the nurse too, yeah. The nurse. Yeah, there's like there's like a few MILFs. I, I can't remember off the top of my head, because I like I don't go out of my way to do like every social link every time. But yeah, there's there's always some older woman in some capacity. In P5 we had two. You know? Not to mention, this school's owned by the Carijo group, right? As I begin my term oh, as sorry, Ignis council. Ignis is in the office now, guys. Like he wants to share pets. with you my vision for this coming. Oh yeah, there's three. It is my firm three? belief that each of us must accept the responsibility of bettering our Oh yeah, that's right, the journalist. I forgot about her. <laughs> change cannot occur without sustained effort and an unprecedented level of commitment. Also, please, nobody check the age of my passport. Thank you. That is why we must restructure our daily lives in order to rise to this challenge. I, what high schooler? <laughs> looks and sounds like this. I'd like each of you to dig deeply into your well of motivation and reevaluate your convictions. The Iowa caucus is quaking with Mitsuru around. She's so she's so fucking a bold new future presidential. Without losing sight of the realities around you. A rich one, I guess. Yeah. My own ideas. One is from a wealthy family. This is, this is what money buys you. Ages you up by like seven years. Education. Your participation, opinions, Ignis, and what are you doing? Are essential. Thank it's a you. rare case where I have like all the trash out of my office right now, or like, cause I mean, like Ignis gets into anything, he'll get into anything. I uh, have any idea what she just said? God, Iggy, you're so fool. Oh my god. And uh, now he's now he's like he's standing he's standing on my lap and he's just rubbing his head up against the table and I'm just petting him. I wasn't listening. <laughs> You're such a rebel. Sorry, I was bet I was busy petting my cat, Mitsuru. You need to understand. Okay, time for now, she's not Mitsuru's not just a mommy, she's a rich mommy, alright? Th that's real gold. Alright, great poem and la da 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 da. Alright, um, I'm actually, I'm gonna get my uh, courage up. Alright, I'm gonna close my eyes. It's nap time. I was busy last night. Everyone knows she's undercover, but uh, no, if they tell her, she'd cry, so they just pretend not to. Everyone's just in on it, on the grift. Alright, now I got both cats in here. What's going on? Oh, Mr. Ignis. Alright, I'm getting my courage. Grow your brain. I, I did a I did a brain growth last time. We're gonna alternate between sleeping and studying. Yo, wanna stop by Paulonia Mall on the way back? Are you gonna take me out on a date, or are you actually gonna win that crane game? I wanna stock up while we can, since we got stuff going on. Oh shit, that's right. Okay, do we get to meet the store where it's like, hey, it's the cop? There's a pharmacy there too. Couldn't hurt to get some meds in case anything happens. You seem really into this. You bet I am. If we don't step up to Let the plate, you who will? Mitsuru's arena design was so WTF when I saw it. I was like, you became my favorite persona. She's fucking sick, honestly. Dad, I thank you for the hundred. At least, like, in Persona 4 Arena, she's my main. I'm, I made Mitsuru. At least back when I used to play it. I don't play it anymore, but... The chairman but. said it himself. The fate of the world depends on us. Let's go, leader. First task, escape from the school. Look, it's the Madison Oh, here, here. Wait for us. <laughs> what, but both of the, the gals, gays, and they is coming up to be like, Akihiko, oh my god. Kiss me, you fool. Have you noticed how popular Sonata-san is with the More ladies? simps. Man. Take a look at that. I guess neither of us really got to know him before all this crazy stuff. The fan, yeah, here come the literal, literally the girly pop, the groupies coming in to see their mans. He's the captain of the boxing team. Never lost a single match. I know that's cool and all, but who'd have thought boxing would turn you into a chick man? 
Is it too early or too late to vote date food top? This Stacey should have been here earlier. <laughs> People are going crazy. Hey, are you guys free this afternoon? Akihiko's like, sorry, girls. I'm hanging out with my boys today. Just guys being dudes. We're gonna go admire each other's bodies. Us? Yeah. yeah. I mean, hell yeah. We love to join your little uh, group here. Aki, he goes, I'm not fucking with them. I want to hang out with y'all. <laughs> what about what about our shopping? We can shop later. Jinpei, you said we were going to go shopping. Yeah, of course. No problemo. I want the two of you to meet me at Polonia Mall. Yeah, Sigma male grind set time. Right. I'll be waiting at the police station. Got it? The, the police station? You mean we're not hanging out with your friends? Who? These girls? <laughs> no, I don't even know their names. <laughs> I love how much he just does so it. So much chit chat gives me a headache. He's like, bitches be yapping. Am I right, fellas? Am I fucking right? Yap this, yap that. That's all they know how to do. I'm going on ahead. Don't get Akihiko, me. date me. Akihiko, have my babies. Akihiko. Please don't leave us. I'll, I'll risk it all for you. This, that, or whatever. Shut the fuck up. Yap Central out here. If it ain't protein, I don't want it! Anyway, that's what a real man looks like, guys. That's true Sigma mindset. Anyway, let's go. All right, to the police station. Yeah. Oh, the cherry blossom. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, look at this. You know the place, let's go. What the? All right, you, hey. I'm wait. I'm waiting for my boyfriend. All right, to the mall. Shopping. Get in, losers. Yeah, the only thing Akihiko pounds is protein shakes and shadows. Amen. Oh, it's so, uh, it's so much more lively. Really, like, it, it, it's such a... <sighs> Me getting, like, emotional over, like, NPCs walking around, but it's it really is a thing where, uh, hardware limitations where, you know, they can only have so many models on screen at once and stuff, and, like, now games have come so far where it's just, it's so much, the, the vibe is so much more different, or at least, like, lush. With the simple thing of just like adding some faceless characters walking around and making it seem more hustle and bustly and alive, you know what I'm saying? So that I'm guessing like near the end of the game when things get a little more dire, it gets more desolate, like we're gonna feel it, so. Yeah, I feel KH3 moment. Oh my God, they have NPCs, you know? <laughs> yeah, it feels like an actual mall now. Then I forget to buy shampoo. Just wait for the sale. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Skilled reporter. Hello, young man. Say, um, have you heard of anything about those mysterious cases of, uh, of ordinary healthy people changing overnight? I have. Guess that shouldn't be a surprise. It's all over the TV. All right. Let's go to the cops. Oh. Oi. Thank you. Chris. Friends, it's okay. We're all Kingdom Hearts fans. It's okay to get emotional over NPCs. <laughs> all right, listen closely to the officer's voice. Oh. These are the guys I was talking about earlier. Not him shooting shit with the cops. Hmm. This is Officer Kurosawa. He helps keep our squad well equipped. Oh, and here. This is from Ikutsuki san. Money? That's like. Yeah, okay, that's money. Whoa, is that our war funds? <laughs> you can't fight empty hands. Just call me Lockheed Martin. Like. Kurosawa san has connections. He can secure equipment for us. But these things still cost money. Let's hear that. Let's hear it. Of course they do. Nothing in life is free. That Liam O'Brien? Oh my god, is that Caius Asurus Wrath? Holy shit. I actually do love him. He does a great job in all of his roles. Well Is I'll that him? Better. Thanks again. Damn, for just a little, like, just for the cop? He looks tired, yeah. I've been informed. The Persona Industrial Complex. 
My job is to maintain peace in this city, regardless of the circumstances. All right, hello, officer. Big fan of how you get, like, six extra limbs and, like, punch gods. I'm just an ordinary police officer, but it doesn't take a genius to know something strange is going on here. They got Akihiko to introduce Akihiko! <laughs> is right. Nothing more. If you need something, we can talk in the back. All right. All right, no telling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Buy, we can buy things, yeah. Equipment types. I know words. All right, bye, bye, bye. What'll it be? Got some new ba, things ba. in stock. Check it out if you've got the time. Do, 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 do. That what you want? I never Great. Do, do, it's all yours. Do, do, do. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna sell that. I don't need that shit. All right, I'm also gonna give it to Yukari because God knows she needs it. Um. Everything looks great. It's all yours. Yeah, I'm gonna sell her practice bow. She doesn't fucking need that shit. Professional archer, get out of here. What are you doing? Take as long as you need. All right, and Junpei gets nothing. Uh huh. What are you looking for? All right, yeah, report again. All right. Yep. Nope. I'm gonna exit. Come back soon. I believe the police station's selling weapons. What's more? They only gave us 5,000 yen. Ain't that kind of stingy? I mean, kind of saving the world. Oh, crap. It's this that guy. wanted poster in the back on the little board, that looks like a real picture of somebody. <laughs> I feel like that's like a developer just making a goofy face and they just put it in there. I'm gonna miss the rerun of the Lonely Shogun. What about stocking up? Wow. Well, about that. I'll leave the rest to you, leader. Let's meet up again. You know it. There's a ton of shops and stuff in this place, so you really so should. So unrealistic. An officer of the law would never do something shady. Yeah. They only hire the best of the best. All right. After school activities, uh, making various school activities or charm academics. However, the number of activities engaged in the day is limited. Think carefully. All right. Network feature. Hey, hey, we have the, the Wi-Fi has connected. Yeah. All right. There we go. Look at that. Gave money at the offering, made use of karaoke 100 percent. Ooh, what do we do? What do we do? Oh, the choices are endless. Hmm, let's see. We could we could go get a duck burger. We could go to the cafe. We could sing our little heart out. I kind of want to, did they add like little things? Like little animations? Maybe we should do karaoke. I kind of want to see what that looks like. We can get a duck burger on the way back from school. Ignis, oh my God, Ignis is back in my lap. He really wants pets. Uh, oh, they did? They did add little doodads? Like little animations for it? Check the alley. Oh, it's like with what? The, uh... there's a mysterious door. Oh my God, the velvet room, say no more. All right, yeah, let's pop our head in, at the very least. Hi, Igor. Is this the back entrance, the bathroom, or? Welcome to the Velvet Room. They added Ignis to the game, yeah. At the time, my role by merging multiple personalities. Yeah, okay, yeah. Oop. Indeed. Oh, to that end, as you accumulate cards, if you wish to learn more about fusing personas in greater detail, then come talk to me so that I can talk. I will assist. All right, thanks, babe. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Mm, all right, we can do yeah persona. I have nothing. Hold on, let's talk. Uh, all right, that's actual help. <laughs> I don't need this. All right, let's get out of here. Yeah, we'll do a lot of talking, quote unquote. What social stats do you need to have to get married? <laughs> Asking for a friend, my eternally alone self, as they feel they will never find someone. All right, my advice, you got to max out on riz and stupidity. All right, bitches love that shit. <laughs> Shout out thank you for the hunter. I don't know, I got lucky. I found I found the perfect person, you know, and I feel honored. So it's really, I mean, like, you know, the biggest tip I can give is like not look for it and wait for just life to do what it does, you know?
It's so eerie. And for what? <laughs> Wombology, thank you for the 44 saying Fuka, that is all. Go forth and win just for you, boo. Wombology, thank you for keeping it going for so long. Welcome on back. All right, um, let's do karaoke. Yeah, the door sucks out the music, yeah. Karaoke. 800 yen, that's a steal. Let's go. Yes, yes, spend the day. Time to sing, time to bust along. This was this is literally Anya and I in Japan. Oh, yay! Oh, it's so cool. Oh my god, this is literally what it looks like though. Yeah, when we were like for our honeymoon, um, funny enough, like we had a bunch of people. Like, cause Ani has family in Japan, but she also has like friends that like wanted to take us out. So like, we went to we went to like little room size karaoke. I think like at least like three or four different places. Shit banged, and it was cheap. So so spacious, so much room for activity. Feel my courage. Yeah, I'm really singing out here, busting along. I would imagine like the staff looking in the window, being like, he's not singing anything. He's just like. Staring at the blank TV and bobbing his head. Should we do something? Yeah, 356 for karaoke. That's a fucking steal. Go to Japan right now if you can go, guys. The, the yen is in the toilet and the dollar is up. Welcome back. All right. Oh, I'm about, yeah, hey, mommy, regarding our, okay. Akihiko is still on the mend, and for now, I'd like, okay, lead the team in combat. Best to be prepared. Okay, thank you. Bro thinks he's Lotus Juice. <laughs> Talking to your allies by checking the bulletin board. Talk, taking your allies or talking to your allies. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, I got it. <laughs> I don't know why it's like the bass boost version of it. There we go. That's what it is. Call of Lot. Thank you for the sandwich again. Tr truly. Top bun. Tippity top, top, top. Another top. And the top of it is a sandwich. A beautiful sandwich with a beautiful gamer right there. Call it. Thank you again. And yeah, it's material, girl, for fucking sure. Oh, right. It's actually. Yeah, it was, just kidding. Yeah, the pro tag gets in there and he's just like Oh, going out at night, you're now free to roam this We're free! We're fucking free! No curfew for us! Oh wow, oh my god. Oh my god. The shackles are off, guys. We got Akihiko admiring his punches, his little gloves. He's just an ordinary policeman, but he knows what we do, at least in a broad sense, and helps if we can. Why does he help? How'd you meet him? Well, he helped me out a while ago. Trust me, he's someone you can count on. Um, okay, yeah, sure, Akihiko. Uh, yeah, I'll try. Oh, yeah, I'll trust him as far as I can throw him. So, what do you think? Um, it was eerie. Ends up being natural first impression when entering such a mysterious tower. All right, mom, what's up? Just wanted to chat. Oh, right. God and I, but please use the appropriate. Okay, for the. Blah, 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 blah. Hmm. Just drains me for some reason. The air is so thin at the top of the mountain, kind of feels like it. What about you, Depresso? It's not too bad. Stop being a little baby about it. Use persona. Uh, you know that thing we use to summon our persona is the evoker? Well, I was thinking, why does it gotta look like a gun? I mean, it's like a little uh, nutty to point out. Point a gun at your head and pull the trigger, wouldn't you know? <laughs> it's like, wait a second. Because the imagery is cool, Junpei. Why else? All right. Because this game was made in the early 2000s and everyone was really depressed. <laughs> All right, let's go. Freedom! Ooh, 
Oh. Ooh. Ooh, new little, little, little remix here. Oh, this is crazy. I've never been outside before at night. They normally didn't let me do that. Holy shit. Back at all those foster homes that I was in, they just lock us inside of our rooms and throw away the key, but no, we're free. Oh, we're so fucking free. Salarymen, dance with me. We're free. We're fucking free. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. 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 oh, okay. <laughs> we ate him. <laughs> he's, he's so fucking free, he just ascended. <laughs> oh, this song is awesome. <laughs> the boomer went boom. Oh, this is nice. Go elsewhere. Don't mind if I do. Let's go to the strip mall. Oh, this is really nice. Ooh, new favorite song incoming? This is great. Yeah, seriously. It's like, it's like they, made it, they need to make it look less like exactly like a gun. Fuck it. Make it, make it a slingshot. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, they've been a hundred. They've been a hundred biddies. Yeah, it is. It's literally just one of those things where it's like, why does it look like a gun? Imagery. So the imagery's cool. Can I have a duck burger now? Hold on. Let's see all who's available. Oh, we see we got apathy syndrome. It's hitting already. Beneath the mask is Quake. Yeah, this is giving it a run for its money. Oops, fragment. Something shiny. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, the one and only Womi. Thank you so much. <laughs> welcome in, ra Raiders, welcome in. If you guys uh, don't know the beautiful Womu, uh, my VTuber artist. You can believe it, there we go. Thank you so much. You guys, go ahead and give Womu a, uh, a follow. Twitter, Twitch, you name it. Go ahead and support your local artists. Yeah, follow that cat boy, do it, it's a threat. Any welcome in, y'all welcome, we're playing P3 Reload. We're going through it. For me, the first time, but not the first time with Persona 3, as we know. Buy something to drink. Uh, ooh, SP items, say no more. 110 yen, steal. Oh yeah, this is a great song. All right, what's up? Let's go, let's go quack quack, let's duck it up. Also, uh, Queen of Fate of Trust, thank for the hundred. Say good, good picks there, good picks. Thank you for the hundred. Uh, yeah, as for the Rizza, be delusional, overly confident. You just got to shoot your shot. You know what I'm saying? Queen, thank you so much for the hundred biddies. Thank you. Also, um, Kiba, thank you for getting a sub to Womu! You're very- Unstoppable. Thank you for that. Thank you, thank you. Alright, let's get our duck burger on. I'm so fucking stoked. 1,000. Alright, grab a bite. Yeah, get the courage. I have, like, barely any money. Let's do it. I'm gonna- I'm gonna risk it all. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Worth it! <laughs> I'm in $20,000 in credit card debt, but I need this burger or else I'll die. Oh, he's getting that burger. He has a strange texture, but tastes surprisingly good. Hey, and he's in, th okay, here's my mouse. Yeah, they left it. Mouth hanging out open, they did it. That's all I wanted was them in the background looking dumb as fuck. Oh, it's great. Let's go! He stares into your soul. He ordered the Mr. Beast Burger. Mi <laughs> Gotta get the Mr. Beast Burger so I can get the toy with money spending action. Yo, Depresso, you by yourself today? What was the rumor about you and talking about coming to school together even true? Um. Well, no, as you can see, I'm gonna be mean to him because it's like, bro. You sure? Not like, I, not like I care or anything. 
Anyways, you must be pretty unlucky to have to transfer here. Wait, you seriously don't know? Weird stuff has been happening at this school. There are a couple of folks who say they've heard strange voices, but I guess since you've always wearing those headphones, you probably haven't heard anything. It's like, well, yeah, your powers of observation are nice. How much longer we plan on going? I'm probably actually going to wrap it up soon. Um, won't, won't gonna lie, my jaw is getting a little tired. Um, but uh, hey man, I'm get it's five hours is pretty school. good. So yeah, we'll wrap it up go? soon. Oh God. Well, I mean, but not before, not before he fucking tells us about his master plan. So out of the blue, why are you asking me? No reason, really. Just don't have anything to do. It's later. so weird with the voice acting almost, because it's like, I've always kind of projected my own idea of like what this guy sounds like in my head, and it's like, oh shit, now they have a real voice. If you know what I mean, wink, wink. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the. Did you hit the hacky sack until she kicked balls? If you, if you know what I mean, winkity wink wink. God. <laughs> Thank you for the hundred. Plus, I figured we could finish our chat from this morning. So oh. how about it, man? Let's get some ramen at the mall and talk. Let me tell you about my love for for hot for cougars. Cougar chasing all day long. You decided to go with him. I made no ch the illusion of choice. Mm. Oh, I don't want to hear him slurp, ew! I don't want to hear this man unhinge his jaw. That's what I'm talking about. Oh God, bro, you, even, you didn't even touch your eggs. Oh, was I right or was I right? Soup here tastes great, doesn't it? We've got to put some special ingredient, in it. something no other ramen shop would ever use. His whole social link is just him doing something to unhinge to the MC, going like, "Damn, that's crazy." He doesn't give a fuck. I know, it's so funny. Super in the shop's name. That's like like the, the the comedy of the MC just being like along for the ride with all of these people's unhinged plans, and you're just like, whoa, bro, that's fucking nuts. Ah, my bad. If you slurp ramen, I assume you eat bananas with the peel on. I always geek out a little whenever I eat here. Hmm. <laughs> well, guys, what, what, I don't, what do I do? I mean girl it up? Do I tell him to fucking focus on the job and why we came here? I kind of love being mean to him. Not gonna lie, I think out of all the social links, he kind of deserves it. Um, have to be nice for points. Ah, uh, just shut up and he was written by me. Oh God. Just sh I'm gonna tell him. To sh shut the fuck up, nerd. Uh, yeah. You came here to eat, all right? Not you're talk to me. If we talk too long. Yeah, it's yeah. The way you're savoring your soup, it seems like you really appreciate its flavor. No, it's because you're still talking to me. I'm trying to eat. By the way, the cards reverse if you answer. I don't think they're gonna lock me out this early. This is like the. <laughs> this is like the. This is how social links work. Damn, you just transferred here too. Well, I can't blame you. Man's got to be aggressive in this day and age. Uh, no, no, sir. <laughs> Listen, I know it's the early 2000s and all that. Um, no, we have uh, progressed. No, no. We like gentlemen. To school again sometime. Let me know when you're free. I'll tell you all about my secret plan. Dude, you're gonna flip when you hear it. Like, call the cops flip or what? Like, don't come to school tomorrow plan? I know what it is. I know it's like, I'm gonna fuck my teacher, but I'm just saying, like, the, 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 can you imagine some of me, like, meeting the first day and be like, hey, let's go out to ramen. Bro, I can't wait to tell you about my secret plan. Oh, God. I guess. Where's the one where it's like, socially, go? Oh God! Thou shalt have our blessing when thou choosest to create a persona of the magician Arcana. Uh huh. Okay, it literally just like. Because I want So many red flags. 
All right, yeah, yeah, bonuses. What? It's already dark? Damn, I missed my favorite show. <laughs> Bro's life has fallen apart. Man, for real? Oh well. Oh, let's get going. Oh, for real? I know a man who used to say that too. Swap numbers. Bust out that stuff. Okay, you know what? You guys are talking about Riz. This is half of Riz, all right? This is literally just being forward and out of pocket and just being like, hey, give me your fucking phone number, all right? Go on to Roman with me. Listen to my master plan. Anyway, new cat on the block. Here's how I'm going to seduce my teacher. All right. Oh, God. Oh, f receiving invites by email. You can receive invite. Oh, that's right. They added the messaging system in this. I can use my hot new Motorola Razor to, to message all of my friends and text them. Don't forget to... to, to you guys got to call me past nine, though, because that's when I get free minutes. <laughs> Random guy gifting a sub to... Uh, for real? I imagine all these like random people who are just like now realizing they're something mean like who the fuck? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh god. Bro's got that harassment. <laughs> I got half of Riz, all right. Yeah, very. He's a little Rizzler on the side. This is negative Riz. I think it's like it's. This is Riz that gets you in the door. It doesn't keep you in the club. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I don't want him fucking texting me. How do I block this number? Literally only got a social link you for the perks, bro. You have no clue what my grand plan is. He's got no clue I'm getting EXP uh, boost from hanging out with him. Charisma. <laughs> I have a quantum riz that only works when I'm not looking. <laughs> or is it like, is it Schroeder's, is it Schroeder things like Schroeder's cat or I can't, I can't remember the fucking thing where it's like, you know, the, the, the cat in the box uh, doodad, but it's like a fucking riz. Make sure you're ready in advance. You don't want to be kind of prepared when it's too late. All right, bet. All right, we're fucking free. All right, y'all. Um, considering like we're about to end like clean on the five hour mark here soon, um, I am getting a little tired, and I do have more editing to do today. My voice is getting like you can hear it a little bit. Um, I wanted to go a smidgen longer, but we're gonna be playing this all next week, so or this week. I can see us thinking for the hundred. It works every time. Uh. Turner's Riz, where it only exists if it works. There it is. Thank you, guys. Thank you, people. Y'all know how to have a spell out here. Thank you. All right, y'all. With that, um, we will be continuing the adventure into the dark hour and beyond next time. Yeah? Chill vibes. Good night, Tom.